This week, I made a rage game. It took me one week to finish it, and uh, that was where we left things. We left things at having made a game in one week, and I'm very proud of what it turned into, except for the fact that now n everybody won't shut up about it. Everybody wants to play it. Everybody wants a little taste of this rage game, which means I now have a lot of work to do, because now I have to get this thing somehow ready for some form of a public release. So we're kind of in panic mode slightly, but I gotta, I gotta slow myself down and make sure that everything works and uh, and runs as expected and, you know, has a name and things like that. All the things that you don't really think of. Uh, so, hello everybody. VOD viewers skip ahead. I don't even know if this is going to turn into a VOD, uh, but there are timestamps below, so just skip to those because we're going to be talking for a little bit here. Uh, and then we're going to get into a few things. First, we're going to test the game and make sure everything's working with the new stuff that I did and make sure the save system is working and all the settings and all that actually function. Um, and then we're going to attempt to get the best time in the game, which isn't going to be hard to do because I currently hold the record for the best time in the game, but I want to show you guys me getting a new personal best, even though that really doesn't matter because the game's not out yet. Uh, but the goal is to make sure that with everything new that I've implemented, everything still works and we're actually going to be able to get through it and maybe we do a little bit of programming, other stuff. You guys, you guys know the deal. So welcome in everybody. Hello guys. Let's get started. Uh, give me actually give me a moment. Let me uh, hydrate. Hydration guys, very important. Go scream at everybody in the Discord. By the way, if you guys are uh, if you guys are are in here and uh, and waiting for other people like I am, go st go scream at everybody and let them know that uh, it's panic time and to get in here before we get started. All right. Uh, so, let me, oh, why is Discord always smaller? Why is that a, why? Discord, just fit the screen, thank you. The lights went out in the basement, send help. Yeah, I saw you were struggling over there. Uh, I don't, I, um, I can send a light bulb down, but it might take all of you guys to change a light bulb. I know you guys are a little bit chaotic. Alright, yeah, hello buddy. Hey buddy, how's it going? <laughs> Alright. Let's head over, and, uh, and just, okay. So, here's what's changed. Oh my god, look at all the things that are loaded. Here's what's changed. Okay, can, please, Unreal, work. Just just work like a normal, uh, a good game engine. Good game engine. There you go, okay. So, the music, shut up. You guys love the panic music. The, it's very quiet. There it is. Okay, panic music. Why use a light bulb when one can simply use beautiful fire? Don't like, don't like the basement on fire. Andres, I need you alive, preferably. Cheers, everybody. This is coffee this morning. Uh, this afternoon. God, it's not morning anymore. I've been up since 4.30 a.m. Uh, so, you know, coffee time. I also have an entire thing of honey next to me. In case my voice doesn't want a voice. So I already had to do it once. Uh, okay. So, right now it's called caps capsule fracture, which I already noticed a problem. We're gonna fix that right away. In here... I need to add an outline to this, or I need to increase the... Well, I should probably just do that, and then maybe add an outline? Where's the outline settings? There we go. One. One's good. Two's better. There we go. Nice. Did that actually do anything? Yes, it did. Okay, good. That looks... No, that doesn't look any different. Never mind. Uh, what? Why? Outline size. Two. One. Two? Two. I thought I did something. What did it do a second ago? I don't- did I do the wrong thing? Okay, at least you can read that now. I don't, eh, it looks fine. Whatever. Capsule Fracture is what I'm currently calling it. I don't know what else to call it. So, I'm gonna need your guys' help. That's one of the most important things this stream. So, we need to land on a name. Okay, platform underscore prototype, like I was saying before. Not a fan of that anymore. It sounded cool in my head, but once I wrote it out, it didn't look good. So, I've completely scratched that one out. Uh, if you guys saw in the Discord in suggestions, oh, thank you guys for screaming about this. If you guys saw in suggestions a while, a little while ago, I wrote down some game names, okay? Uh, these are some very simplistic ones, right? Bean Fracture, Capsule Fracture, Rage Fracture. Fracture, I like the name of because it sounds kind of aggressive, sound, it kind of fits the rage vibe. Uh, Bean, I love it because you guys know I love Bean. It does not fit for this game. 
it's a nice little funny reference, but the word bean is too uh, childish, too like funny, kind of silly sounding for this type of game. I want this, like if you were to put the Doom Eternal soundtrack behind the trailer for this game, I want the name to fit that vibe. Uh, so a fracture pro prototype is okay. Prototype fracture better. I think escape the prototype is fine. I'm not as big a fan of that one. Uh, escape the fracture is same thing. I don't really think that fits right now. Capsule fracture is my favorite. I was going to go with just fracture, but that is uh, taken. That is already a game. Yeah. Sag. Uh, but I don't know. We'll, we'll come up with something, but keep, keep your, keep your brains peeled for that one. Gamers. Uh, how is stream running? I forgot to change my uh, monitor settings back. So is stream running smooth? If I if I hit uh, new game here, is this running smooth for you guys? Eh, it looks kind of glitchy. That's that's not as good as I was hoping. Maybe that's maybe that's my own fault. Eh. Capsule bounce training. Yeah, there you go, Andres. That's the one. That's what we'll go for. Does that look alright? Does that look smooth to you guys? Or does it look weird? Because I've had problems streaming before with my different monitor refresh rates. And now I'm trying it. My 144Hz in the center and my 95s on the side. But that didn't work in the past. So if that's working fine now, then great. Because it looks super smooth to me. But if not, then it does lag a little for some reason. Okay, then we're going to change that. Uh, this could break everything. So get ready, gamers. Here we go. First of all, let's just do that. And then here we go. Everybody, everybody get ready. Everybody get ready. Let's, uh, change this. Oh, we gotta do all three of them. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Take one. Okay. We're back. Okay, there's one. Uh, oh, I gotta do it like that. That's annoying. Okay. And then, uh, re get ready, guys. Get re take two. I freeze a little bit when this happens. Okay, we're good. And then, uh, last one. Here we go. Y yep, okay, and we should be good now. Everything should be smooth as butter for you guys now. Unless that wasn't the problem, and then in, th in that case, I'm Sag. Alright, it's fine. So, it, okay, anyway, here's the new menu design. L let, me, let me catch you guys up. Hello, everybody. Hello, Rose. Hey, Maker. Hey, Andres. Hey, Chernobyl. Welcome in. Hi, guys. Hey, Kate. I wanted to make sure I said hi to you guys because I missed it. Yeah, th hey, Josh. <laughs> All right, here's uh, here's what here's what's gonna happen. I set up all the settings. The settings look a little bit better now. Uh, they okay. Well, they look a little dark. The background is too dark. We need to, okay. You know what? This is gonna be this little intro bit here. This is annoying me. This is gonna be like 0.25, and that'll be better. We're gonna be doing these kinds of tweaks for a little while. That doesn't look any better. It needs to be darker. What am I doing? Uh, let's make it like 0.8. I didn't press the button. There we go. That's really dark. That should be good, right? That looks fine. You know what? It's good enough. It's because I make... Oh, that... Okay, another thing. Another thing here in the setting. This is visible, and it needs to be not hit test visible. There we go. That'll be better. Because that was a problem earlier that I forgot about. There we go. That's better. Okay. So now, yeah, they light up when you hover over it. It does not work with gamepad. Or unless it does, and it magically, and I just don't realize it. Hey, and welcome in, princess. Okay, it does not, it confirmed it does not work with the gamepad. Unless I click on one, then all of a sudden it starts working with the gamepad. Why? I don't know. Still doesn't really, no it doesn't, these don't work anymore. Okay, so yeah, it doesn't work with the gamepad. That's besides the point. But, you know what, it's fine. <laughs> greetings one, greetings all. Thank you for the ease. Cheers everybody. Okay, so this all works now though. It does save. I know you guys were freaking out about it not saving, but it saves now. Everything saves correctly. I hope this is working correctly because it wasn't before. So we're going to find out if I do that, I save and return, uh, and I quit and then I play. It does not. Okay, so the resolution is still broken. <laughs> oh, why? I don't, I don't know why that's a problem. But everything else stays the same. Uh, I have a few new settings in here. What do you think about the name Proto Pill? I don't want to go with Pill. Pill does not fit the the vibe of the game. <laughs> Proto Phil, yes, of course. 
Uh, yeah, I was I was thinking about including the word prototype in it, but I think we want to stray away from the word prototype because the word prototype, uh, it, one, it, there's a lot of games with the name prototype. Apparently, there's an entire franchise called prototype. There are a lot of games called like prototype colon this. Um, so that does I don't really want to do that because of that, but also because prototype in general. Uh, incentivizes that the game isn't finished and even though the point is for the game to kind of be ongoing indefinitely and never really be finished or at least the design is never it, it's meant to look unfinished I don't want that to be in the title because then people are going to assume it's a prototype so we're gonna stay away from that um, potentially unless we find some awesome name that involves prototype in which case sure let's include it but for now no uh, had another nightmare about this game. Reasonable. You're about to have more after today because you're gonna see me fly through it no problem. Uh, okay. Anyways, yeah, so there's a few new things in here. Auto respawn. Andres, you're welcome. Uh, there is auto respawn now. So I, I showed him this before, but if we die, it will automatically respawn us. And if you turn that off, then obviously it won't. Uh, next thing is save my bitrate. Now we're gonna try this on stream. Okay, we're, we're gonna see here what this does. Okay, so here's what it is. Here's what the world looks like right now, right? You see all the you see all the little things here. This is what it looks like now after I turn on save my bitrate. There's a lot more little grid pieces, and so there's a little bit less for it to render, I think, unless we need to go the other way. I tried it the other way, it didn't look as good, so if this helps the bitrate, then great. If not, then we'll go the other way. Yeah, it doesn't look as good, but the point isn't for it to look better, the point is for it to look better, to like, for not to pixelate as much on stream. So, if the bitrate is better this way, then we'll do it this way, if not, we'll do it a different way, but for now, it's it's as good as it's gonna get so those are the two additional settings now that have been added uh, obviously there's all the typical stuff I also removed the textures because I know that does nothing I don't think anti-aliasing does anything but it looks like it does a little bit also I found what the screen tearing design issue was it is well it one it's v-sync when v-sync is on it happens but uh, it's not happening right now. Why is that not? Is VSync not working? Oh god. Okay, there's more problems, but uh, Let's turn off save my bitrate because th this does look way better. Uh, yeah, it's not. Oh, I know why it's not working because it's not doing it for editor um, R dot VSync editor uh, One okay, so I still can't really tell is it because motion blurs down Motion blur get back up to half I also changed, yeah, motion blur is now a slider instead of a quality adjustment, so this, this will look better. Um, but, okay, well, we can't tell right now. I think it's an editor thing, I don't know. But, uh, the issue is that it's using, um, it's the type of anti-aliasing that it's using. I don't know, I, I, I can't remember what it is, but it, it's what makes this either look okay or terrible. And this already doesn't look great, I wish it would work transparent, but if it's transparent then we can't do the outline or the, like, highlight behind objects thing, which is really annoying. Was it 75k you said for me? Yes, Spoon, yes I did. But then you said something that made me push it up, so I don't know, I don't know, we'll see. <laughs> we'll have to chat about it. Do you have 75k, is that what it is? Is that, is that what's going on right now? Um, okay. Other than that, that's all the settings. That's the chaos that we've uh, been through with this. Okay, did that actually change anything in terms of quality here? Oh, it does! Okay, so we are going to leave anti-aliasing because it does make this look different. Does it look as good? I don't know. It's up to you guys to decide. But I know the other types of, uh, of anti-aliasing don't look as good. So, I kind of have to do that. Um, other than that, controller does work, just doesn't work with menus. Sensitivity control, motion blur is a slider now, I said that. Auto respawn, obviously all your other basic ones. Other than that, I think that's pretty much everything. Okay, um, so why did that happen? Oh, that's a problem. Okay, that's annoying. Uh, all right, so we're gonna, we're, we're gonna see what happens here. First of all, I wanna make sure that this works. If I confirm, start over. Um, Right now, right now what happens is, so let, let's, let's get a couple of deaths here. 
So right now it's at nine seconds, or okay, 11 seconds, two deaths. If I quit out and I start back in and hit continue, we're at 12 seconds, two deaths. So it saves when you quit the game. Uh, I think I also need to make it save when you rage quit in general. I haven't done that yet. Can't think capsule can work as a hardcore thing in the name. It sounds better than pill or bean. It's the most uh, aggressive of the words that fit. So like capsule fracture to me sounds best so far. It looks okay written. I don't know. I'm indecisive. I'm very indecisive. Uh, okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to new game and we're just going to try to get the best score we can. Rage against the machine. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's a little, just a little bit taken. All right, here we go. Let's try to get the best time we can. I'm already messing it up. That's not a good start. Yep, bad start. It's fine. I know I can do this in 20 seconds, so I'm going to slip up trying to get the fastest speed here, aren't I? I sure am. It's all right. Let's do the best we can here. Nope. Oh, wait, I need to change my title anyway. Oh. I also quit. That's bad. My computer is screaming at me. All right, let's change the title and then let's go for it. Uh, this will be getting a new PB in my unreleased rage game. There we go. Wonderful. Cool. Okay. Uh, done. There we go. All right. You're welcome, gamers. Uh, I should change this to games and demos, shouldn't I? Yes, I should. Games plus demos. And uh, you guys, you're, you're going to have to suffer with me with the repeating music that I've heard all too much lately. All right. New game. Here we go. I also think the motion blur is gross looking right now. Is that just an editor thing? I don't know. I should be able to get this in no deaths. Bean block cow juice. I don't, what? I was not there for that. What happened? What? What spawned that demon phrase? All right. Whoop. Man, I am not doing well right now. said no prototype but how about proto it's okay it sounds kind of robotic to me man uh, looking at chat while trying to speed run is not great all i have to do i'm gonna do multiple runs of this today all i have to do is beat 18 minutes and like 80 deaths to get a new pb why does the gravity... Okay, am I crazy? Or does the gravity feel slow? Is it because I'm an editor? Hold on. Why does it feel floaty? I did not change that. Okay, if I'm, I'm just going to drop everything. And we're going to see if that feels any better. So maybe it's because I'm streaming it. That kind of feels better. Looks gross. That does feel better. What is my computer doing right now that it can't handle this? Okay, we're gonna we're gonna do this. We're gonna make a build of this. No, we're not. We need to fix a few things before we do this. Okay, we need to let's let's slow our roll here. Before we do the actual playtesting, let's let's fix a few things here. Make it so you can fly. I just wanna see the second room. No way, we're gonna get to we're gonna get through the whole game. We just need to make sure things are working first. What did I say was broken? The resolution was broken. Of course. Uh, okay, why is this broken now? My monitor's changed. I just realized that as well. Okay, let's just bring back the calming chill music. Okay, let's let's bring that in and let's let's fix this game and then we'll do well then we'll start. We'll start that soon. Okay, I got to slow myself down cuz it's been a little while since we've uh we streamed it's been a couple days since I streamed last, so I got to fix some things. You will curse Vano so he can't make it past the first checkpoint. Well, see, here's the thing. I've done that so many times now that I don't think you could stop me. You might be able to stop me from getting past the third checkpoint, but not anything earlier than that. I'll let chap GPT cook and get this. I'm concerned about what you're about to paste. All right, what is my... Okay, big problem right off the bat is that the resolution isn't working. So when it's doing this, it's setting it... 
to find this, and it's finding something, but it's not finding the right thing. And I don't know what is wrong with that. Like, capsule Carnage. That sounds like a carnival. <laughs> that's that's incredible and horrible, and I am not never going to use it ever, not in a million years. Okay, let's let's get. One of the things that I changed when I was trying to set up the menus with controller support was now it's using a player controller rather than everything being controlled in the bean, which is going to be better for m potential multiplayer support, but for now, it's just a mess, and everything's everywhere. But right now, not in the player, I'm in the wrong one, in the game instance, at the beginning, we're getting all the supported resolutions, we're defining the that stuff, that's all fine. Oh, it's not actually- wait, is it saving? Did I actually do that right? I didn't think I did that right. I guess that's working. That's fine. Okay, cool. Uh, it's loading the settings. If not, it's creating the settings. And that's the problem. No, it's not the problem. It's getting the last index and sending that to the resolution. Here, it's getting the resolution... And that's it. So it should be fine. Why is it not saving the resolution? Why is that a problem? Why is that not working? That doesn't make any sense. That should be working. Uh, because then here it takes the resolution and it finds it. So maybe I should just do... No, I need to... Yeah, no, I find... Okay, I need to pull up my other project here. We're going to pull up the Lixian game. Because in here... I did it right and it was working and I don't know why it isn't now. But, yeah. Capsule Abyss. Nope. <laughs> not quite, ChatGPT. Good try, though. Uh, in the settings menu for this here, it's going to be even more chaotic, good lord. It sets the resolution options. And then later, display mode, screen percent, gamma, v-sync. Does it really just skip resolution? Or does it just do that here? It just does that here. Because resolution is there. So that sh Why is that now? Oh, I know why that's not working. That's annoying. Okay. Uh, well, we're gonna break some stuff real quick. Alright, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna save all. We're gonna go into my UI structures and- nope. In my save structures, in my video settings, we're gonna add- Wait, I already have- Oh, I'm just an idiot. I'm literally just a moron. Did I just change things? Okay, we have to close the thing now without saving. Oh, that's dumb. Alright, it's fine. Let me just delete my saves, open this back up. Okay, this is going to be fine. <laughs> okay. Now, in... Where is it? In UI settings, in here, where are we saving? We're not saving. We're setting things. That's fine. It's this. I'm just an idiot. This is literally giving me the resolution right here, and that's all it needs to be. Right there. And then we just need to set that when we do this. We are doing that. I'm dumb. I'm big dummy. Okay, that's fine. Cool. Great. Awesome. Play. Settings. Why did it set it to the lowest one? And it didn't give me an error. It just set it to the lowest one. So if I set this to that and then I play okay it saved it but it's starting out with the wrong value that doesn't make any sense so it needs to set members in do this and then set the default no it is setting default so it does that but if it doesn't have a default that's the problem because this needs to be defined when we start it in the game instance here it's setting resolution that's the where the problem is okay so it needs to do this earlier or I guess it doesn't you can just do this resolution options last index there okay there we go now if I delete the save now it'll be fine I don't know why there's so many things here and then in here save games delete the settings save now I start it settings Starts at the maximum resolution. Cool. Okay. We're good now. That fixed that. What was the other problem? Oh, it was the... It popped up when I... Okay. That didn't make any sense. Huh. Okay. 
Interesting. Capsule Frag. Capsule Torment. These are terrible. <laughs> Maker, stop asking ChatGPT. Tell ChatGPT to get a real job. All right. Why does that seem laggy? Do I need to change something in my settings? Okay, motion blur's fine. Auto respawn's fine. V-Sync is off. That's it right there. Um, and then save my bit rates off. That's all fine. Cool. Still seems kind of laggy. It seems weirdly floaty to me right now. I don't know why. But, okay. As long as that works. Okay, now if I go here, I rage quit. Uh, we're playing two pieces of music at the same time. I hit... It doesn't give me a continue. Because I haven't quit out yet. So if I rage quit from the pause menu, I need it to save as well. So, where is that? In... UI pause menu. Okay, this is this is where things get interesting because we're almost done here. I just need to do this as well. Getting player. This is gonna stop timer. It's also going to save save current level. There we go. Cool. So that'll do that no matter what. Sweet. Uh, last thing. I guess I can also do that in the main menu as well. Just to make sure that it's safe. Or I guess I shouldn't from here. Yeah, I shouldn't from there. Okay. Cool. So now it didn't say it did save because it shut down. But if it doesn't shut down, then like let's play here. New game. And I'm not gonna shut it down. Okay, now it's running smooth again. I don't know what's up with that. Okay, and now I rage quit. It did create the save, but it didn't load. Huh. It didn't load the continue here because it didn't have the save yet, which is frustrating. I feel a bit unusual interacting with AI like me while well, I don't have a job in the tr Okay, shut up, ChatGPT. Uh, do you need capsule in the name? I don't need capsule in the name. I would. Uh, that's the only thing that I'm like. I feel like it would fit, but if you can find, if you can come up with one that doesn't have capsule in the name, that's fine. It just needs, I, I like Fracture. It doesn't have to have Fracture in the name either. No, nothing is set in stone, but I like the word Fracture just like as a general word for it, but eh, I'm, I'm eh on all of it. Uh, okay, what I need to do is when we quit to main menu, I need to tell it somehow that the save does exist so you can continue. What about fragment? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't really like the sound of it. Just as a word. Like, eh. Okay, where is... When I go from pause, and I show main menu, I need to tell the main menu that it has a save. So... No, that's not it. Um... In here, in main, okay, fine. I'll just do it this way. We just gotta, we gotta do things simply. Has save, okay. Uh, what I'm gonna do is, in here, when we show main menu, we're gonna set has save. So where is that? Main menu, set has save. At the very end. Uh, and then we're gonna have has save. Uh, no has save. And if this is true, okay, we're going to select here. If it's true, then it's going to be true. If it's false, then it's going to be whatever it currently is. Okay, we're going to get, get has save. Actually, wait, why am I doing it like that? Literally just a branch to see if we know it has save. If it does, then we'll tell it that it does now and if it doesn't if we don't know for sure then we won't say it but here is the only place we're gonna say yes from rage quitting from the main from the pause menu that way we can skip over the check previously because it's only doing it once isn't it that's why that's fine because if I get rid of that now I start now new game we make it like two steps, we rage quit, now there's a continue button, we continue. It didn't set us back at the checkpoint. Why? Why didn't that spawn us? 
we hit continue we hide the menu it's not complete if it is complete then we skip starting the timer but this still needs to spawn us did i just turn off spawn no it still spawns at the end what did i do wrong oh it's because it's okay this is already valid so we can skip that part to here there we go that's good that's good okay now i go i hit continue it spawns us i rage quit i hit continue it spawns us okay cool there we go i'm good with that that works we're gonna make a build and we're gonna hope that there's nothing else that i missed because i'm pretty sure that's everything and I'd much rather test this in a standalone build than in the editor. So let's do that. Create the build. As you can see, that's all I've been doing basically lately. Is just making new builds of the game and going from there. There we go. Okay. Snap time CR. It's the issue. Well, thanks for hanging out. Appreciate you. Can you stop using ChatGPT now? Yeah, it's not the greatest. That's why I didn't go there in the first place. <laughs> Fractured trials. Uh, mm, mm. Eh, the pro so here's the here's the funny thing you bring up trials which uh, the reason I'm like eh, is because I was kind of already thinking trials because trials is kind of how I wanted to phrase the different levels like right now it's only one long level with seven checkpoints um but later on I want to kind of take you know how each I don't know for those of you who have actually seen all of the sections you know how each section kind of tries to introduce an idea or like expand upon an existing idea uh, well, in the in the full release game, this would be like a final challenge trial level where leading up to that you would complete like five smaller levels that like teach you about the mechanics and then the last level it completes that idea and like challenges your skill at all of those ideas. So I would call them trials potentially. Um, but for now it doesn't really fit. So that's where and plus outlast trials, I think like that uh, that kind of thing. I don't know if I want trials in the name, but I think trials is is kind of the the general idea of how the levels will be phrased and uh, and and presented later on. I like fracture. I don't like fracture past tense. I was talking to my dad about this. Fractured uh, ten uh, seems, at least to me, to uh, to say that something happened before the game takes place something fractured before the game takes place now the game has been influenced by the fact that something fractured in the past whereas fracture implies that that is an action that will occur during the main game uh so i don't want to use even even in a context like that um which fractured trials implies that the trials are fractured which doesn't really fit because the bean is what gets fractured um but even in that case, it, it doesn't really feel like it lines up perfectly. Uh, but I, I like Fracture way more than I like Fractured. Which is, I, I know it's a subtle difference, but it's, it, to me, at least in my marketing brain, uh, is, is a big difference. Oh, one remain. Is it going to be done quickly this time? Good. I don't know why that's so loud, but there we go. I'm back. I had to switch from phone. Well, you just missed my entire spiel. Um, basically, fracture sounds better than fractured because fracture is uh, sounds more like an action, whereas fractured sounds more like a past tense story beat that happened before the game takes place. So something fractured before the story occurs, which influences where the story is now versus fracture which implies that that is an action that will occur during the game that's my outlook on it where even in that case like fractured trials implies that the trier trials are somehow jesus christ that was loud the trials are somehow the thing that is broken which doesn't fit because fracture is applied to the capsule or the bean in this case not the trials themselves so it doesn't fit as well it's my marketing brain trials of fractures so that's more fitting I don't I'm, uh, eh. I'm looking for that one thing that's like, that's the one, you know? So if I keep going, eh, to all your ideas, don't be offended by it. It's literally just me, like, eh, I think we could do better, you know? Okay. Uh, I don't know if you guys saw the capsule spinning there in the title. Jesus Christ, that's loud. But, yes, I did set that up. Okay, there we go. Cool. That was very loud. Capsule fracture. Wait. Yeah, exactly. It's already, it's already in the name. Already in the name. All right. So 
we're gonna try the first run we're just gonna leave everything as is and then the second run we're gonna go through with the uh with the change of the save my bitrate just to see what happens see if it works any better all right everything is as it should be i will leave auto respawn off okay here we go first run happening now let's do this thing yeah this runs way smoother out of the editor thank god you're gonna hear me slamming my spacebar because for whatever reason when i play this game i slam the spacebar way harder than i need to i should just okay i should try to go a little bit slower so i'm not respawning a bunch because that's gonna be a huge problem uh because i'm trying to like i'm trying to speed run so my brain is like go as fast as possible take as many shortcuts as you can that's probably not the best solution here I just saw a notification and it distracted me. Good job, me. Alright, let's at least get out of the first room so people can see what's beyond here. Because there is more beyond this area. I am an idiot right now. I am doing terribly. I need to stop. Once again, I need to stop rushing it. Stop rushing it and everything will be fine. Cool. There we go. Alright, checkpoint one. Sweet. Sweet pipes nope this is the one i reset on a lot because i try to go extremely fast i try to do my like wraparound jumps without even looking like that which is pretty good i'm pretty good at that i'm gonna skip to here and jump around the corner more pipes all right cool more pipes sweet okay and then i feel like pipes is easier than the first room i don't know Pretty sure I just broke a jaunch. I sure did. I'm sure I did. I am sure I did. I'm gonna do the skip here. Whoops. Well, I'm gonna mess up the skip. There's a skip in this room that I really like because it is significantly faster than anything else. All right. Run past that. I love the sound effect. It's great. All right. Let's try to do. It. Nope. That was terrible. I want to. I want to get the skip. The skip makes you feel epic, and it also does save time because otherwise you're spending time waiting for the moving platform. I'm wasting a lot of time here trying to show off the skip, but we'll see. I don't think I'm going to beat my time the first time through because I haven't... Wow, I messed that up. I didn't jump. Um, I haven't done a full run in like a day or two at least because I've just been programming. I also don't do the skips normally, so this is not going to be good for my time. Right now, I'm probably going to get a, like a 20-minute run. Oh, I missed that corner. The corners are really hard to hit. The hitbox is exactly the like the radius of the capsule. So there is no like forgiveness here. Wow, that was just I don't know what happened there. That felt like that should have worked, but it didn't. There are definitely places where Oh, that was terrible. Maybe I shouldn't do the skip. Maybe I should just not do the skip. I usually can get it. After a couple tries. I'm just not getting it right now, though. Come on. Whoop. Corner. Corner. Nice. Okay, there we go. Skip to this platform. That's assuming you can get that on your first try. It's only a skip. It's only a time save if you get it on your first try. Which I did not. So not really a time save. Not bad. Alright. Lasers. Introduction to lasers. For those of you who haven't seen lasers yet, here you go. Laser time. Alright. Now, lasers is a bit of random chance in a sense. Uh, because they don't reset when you respawn. So getting the perfect lineup is not always a guarantee. But I kind of got a good lineup that time, so not too bad. Moving platform. Cool. Let's get to this checkpoint in one try, please. Yes, first try. I think I didn't die at all there, did I? Nice. All right. First try lasers, which technically aren't done yet, but close enough. Whoop. Okay. Whoop. Whoop. Jump to the camera. My favorite little trick there. Now we wait for this. I let this do its cycle. I can't really do um, 
the, the this part there isn't really a skip to because you can't jump two blocks so you just kind of have to wait for it uh and then whoop i missed that sometimes but got it that time it's fine to reset there i did it again man these jump arounds are not fun okay also introduction to freeze lasers here i cannot jump around that once i get there man i don't know why i'm struggling with that one there we go and I'm frozen. Uh-oh. Nope. Let me go. Oh my god. It does give you a slight grace period when you touch a spike from a certain angle to where you just kind of glide. I did not program that. I don't know why it's like that. I messed that up. Uh-oh. Yeah, I've been dead there. And we're back to the beginning. Well. Barely made that. There, there are some things that you can do to skip here, but a lot of them really aren't worth it or just aren't at all reasonable to try to do. Okay, let's go fast here. Okay, it's coming back. Uh-oh, this might have been bad timing. This was bad timing. Yep, bad timing. It's all right. Nope. Should unrelenting be in the name? Uh, n n maybe? <laughs> it's kind of fitting, but... Yeah, you could do that to trigger those spikes preemptively. I don't tend to do that, though, because it's kind of risky and not really that worth it. Okay, this one, now it's going. Now we're good. It's going in the right direction. So we can avoid that. Jump around. Trigger it. Oh, that is, that's the hardest one right there. I think out of everything in this room, that is definitely the hardest piece of it. Nope. Mess that up. Unrelenting Fracture. Kind of, kind of the best one so far. Still like Capsule Fracture more. Okay, if I can beat 80 deaths, that's also a, a plus. But I am not doing myself any favors right now. There we go. Alright. Speed. I will catch up on chat here soon. Probably. I promise. I don't promise, but I will try my best. Because it's very hard to read chat right now while doing that. Okay, that is definitely the hardest part of this. Or one of the hardest parts. There's another really hard part coming up. But we'll get to that. This is definitely best to do top down. Trigger that. Now we're good. Jumping over this is nothing. Jumping over this one sucks. I jumped around? That was weird. That was not how I normally do that. And I died because of it. So, makes sense. Unyielding fracture. That sounds more like farming to me for some reason. I don't know why. Maybe it's just because of the yield. Yeah, let's, let's E. Everybody spam E. Distract me with your E's. Try your best. Alright. Speed that. Nice. That's definitely the scariest of the jumps. This one's more like the most panic-inducing of the jumps. Right here, because you're already going pretty quickly. There we go. And if you freeze, it's fine, as long as you don't do... As long as you don't freeze there. Okay, well now you're eating so much that I can't even talk. <laughs> okay, stop the E's! No more E's! That's not an E! Oh god, what have I done? Oh god! Okay, well... This, this and the last room are definitely huge time killers. If you're not, uh, if you're not really, really good at these rooms, which I am not. I'm not great at this room. I'm not great at the next room. If you're not, like, incredible at them, you're gonna, you're gonna suffer here. You're gonna lose a lot of time on this, on these couple rooms, and I'm gonna die. Yep. God. Freeze lasers are very unforgiving here. That's for sure. God, anybody who hops in after e-spam, if they're new to stream, what are they going to think? What are they going to think happens at our streams, guys? What's going through their heads? I, wow, that was just terrible of me. Alright. Oh, here comes the final run of deaths. If I could get out of here before 40, I'd probably get less than 80, but I don't think I'm going to get less than 80 deaths now, just because that last room is painful beyond anything. The last room, like I've said many times, is harder than all of the previous rooms combined. Nice. That is definitely the hardest to dodge. If there's a jump in the- ah, oh, I'm gonna die again. If there's a jump in the game that I don't think people will be able to do if they get past the first rooms, it's gonna be that one, probably. And it's not even a jump, it's just a, a little spin around. Andres is a god gamer, and that is, I believe, really the only reason he was able, wow, I was not doing good there. Uh, the only reason he was able to get through this, because I do not consider myself a great gamer. I built the game, so it's to be expected that I'm doing 
okay. But Andres, I w was handed this game, had never played it before. I mean, he played he play tested early versions, but like, I mean, basically he hadn't really played the game before, especially the other rooms, which he had not played before at all. And he just picked it up and just championed his way through it. Like, that was extremely unexpected. I, at first, I kind of expected that, oh, yeah, you know, first should be able to do this. Uh, once I realized how insane that thought process is, uh, yeah. The fact that Anders was able to do it is extremely impressive. The fact that he had the willpower to do it is extremely impressive. And if I'm right about that, he is the only person besides me to have actually beaten the game so far. I'm, I got really lucky on that one right there. Trying to pay attention and talk at the same time. Very difficult. Forgive all your uh, gaming content creators who struggle to form words sometimes. It is not an easy task. Alright, come on. Please. Yes. Okay. We're good this time. No! We're not good this time! Oh, I jumped into the spike. That was stupid of me. I don't know why I tried to trigger that. That was just dumb. Wow, I'm not doing well. I don't know why. Why do I want to do that? I don't want to do that. Two hours, sir. Uh, this will not take me two hours to beat. It, uh, it may have taken you guys several hours. It did not take me. I'm dead. <laughs> it will not take me two hours. Uh, I will finish this run. I was going to reset it if I just didn't get my PB, but it's fine. I wish I took a screenshot of my PB because it was it was 18 something and I don't think I'm gonna get that my first run I did way better in this room when I did that so we will probably hit it today I don't see why not I'm getting practice in right now again like I said I haven't tried to run uh, at least for the past two days because I've been doing only menus which is just pain but now I'm getting the hang of it again yeah we're good now as long as we don't freeze there nice now we're here okay final room and I'm dead immediately. Final room is uh, definitely the most painful. I did speed up the lasers, so this is a different version than Andres played. Uh, he actually worked with me to fix up the uh, the design of the room a little bit. It's not that much different. The only real difference that I remember is the speed of the lasers. I'm frozen. Dead. Bad there. The speed of lasers and maybe like one position change of like a, a platform. I don't remember exactly, but we made very few small changes to it based on Andres' experience. And I think it is much better now. It's not that much different. It's not easier, but it is, it is better. These jumps are not easy jumps, by the way. None of these jumps are easy jumps. The hardest part about this room is the fact that it is a combination of every aspect of the game that's been introduced up to this point without any checkpoints. Okay, there we go. I didn't even look for that one. I just remembered. Okay, there we go. All right, now we just got to wait for this laser. It's going to freeze me, and then it's going to go back. It's going to, once it goes left, we can go. Right, there we go. Now, this laser is going to home in on you, and I'm dead. I missed that jump I went too early. It's fine. So, this is why I say you can really rack up deaths here. That was pretty close to the end. There's another moving platform section up there, but I'm frozen. My muscle memory is kicking in. Well, I did also build this one most free, or most recently, so I'm, I'm most familiar with the design of this room. Also, I built the game in a week, so it's not like I'm going to lose that much muscle memory over the past, what, three days where I haven't played it. Well, minus that one. I do like the ominous homing laser, just like, because you learn earlier in the level that the pink ones are homing lasers. So the fact that this one isn't homing on you yet, it's just roaming around ominously, is, is a very nice, fun touch. I, I pat myself on the back for that one, because it does come into play later. It's just down here, it's like, oh god, when's it going to kick in? I keep freezing. I cast god gamer stealing. Well, you're doing a pretty good job right now. Because I'm just kind of dying to stupid things over and over and over again. Yep. We we might get a sub 18 minute. I don't know. Because it is just kind of like 
You get lucky some runs, like that. I got very lucky on that position. Like, I could have waited. I couldn't have really waited, though. Uh, oh, that would that would have been timing to go. I guess I could technically still go, but I'm not going to risk it. I'll wait for it to do its thing. I'd rather stay safe here, because this is a safe point. This is that You don't get hit by, hit by anything other than the freeze laser here, which doesn't matter. It's just kind of a funny shock. Uh, but then after this... You do have to you do have to speed run and the laser still got me. Oh, that sucks. Why was it still homing on me there? I don't think it should be there. Cuz it's not on the block next to that. I don't know why it was still doing that. That's weird. That was a miss. Best we've done. Laser bug potentially or I just did that wrong and it shouldn't be homing there still and that was my mistake, but I don't know. We'll we'll look at it afterwards. Remind me of that one position, because that's not supposed to do that. So I want to make sure it doesn't... There we go. Uh-oh. It's coming back. No, it's not. It's going forward. Okay. This is a very simple pipe section in comparison to the other ones, but... Still good that it's there. Okay, it's going to go there, and then now is our chance... We go here, we go here, and we go here, and we're good. Okay, yeah, see, it didn't get me that time, so I think it just bugged out. It's weird. Okay, then there's this one. You have to bait this. Uh, oh, yeah, we changed this section. Great, I don't remember how this section goes. I think it's just... Well, I died there, so it is just squeezing by now. Yeah, that's it. Okay, that was a section we changed. I forgot about that change. That's fine. Not bad. Well, that was bad, but not bad. Welcome in, Waffles. How's it going? Am I going to get... I might not get sub-18 here. That was... I swear I jumped there. Alright, whatever. Not bad for a first run, though, for sure. Because I think we we have it. Once we get back there, we kind of have it for this one. Well, assuming we get back there in the next minute. Pfft, I just bumped that... I swear I bumped that spike there. The collision detection is mostly unforgiving, but I guess sometimes it can be kind of unforgiving. Or forgiving. What, what am I saying? You guys know what I'm trying to say. You get it. Oh, it's coming back. Oh, that was bad timing. Yep, that was terrible timing. Well, remember, this is meant to be the hardest room in the game by far. Like, this is supposed to take everything you've learned up to this point and make it just tenfold. Combine it all together, no checkpoints. Just pain. Man, my my jumping is not on point here. There we go. I'm frozen. Alright, good timing. And frozen. Bad timing. Alright. So I made an exam. Yeah, basically. This is basically the exam room, but it's a video game, so it's it's a little bit less uh, less PTSD inducing. Okay, that was just running against the clock is a bad idea here. Okay, I jumped really late there. I'm surprised that counted. Uh-oh. Yep. <laughs> Getting past this first set of lasers. This is definitely the room that has the best like laser design because they're actually like set up to hit you in specific points. The other rooms are kind of just like chaotic lasers to get you introduced to the fact that they can be chaotic. But in this room, they're calculated to get in your way and be really like specifically difficult. Um, yeah, we're, we're over 18. Well, so much for a sub 18, but hey, first try, not bad. I'd really like to get through this room though. Well, it's also gone up like 10 degrees since I started this, so flannel is coming off very soon. Whoop. Nice. Alright. And I'm frozen. Man, the timing on that is hard to get. Because you could just, like, you could sit and watch and then jump at the right time. So it's not forcing you to go at random timing. It's just really hard to tell. There we go. Alright. Jump. Nope. Man. That jump is very difficult. 
I made this, so this is the first room, basically, right? This is a recreation of the first room, right here. Plus lasers, so... Recreation of the first and fourth or fifth room? Whatever lasers is. Okay, and then there's the moving platform section, which would be room three. Man, now I'm just missing that jump. Nope. I'm, th I'm thinking about other things, so I'm not performing as well. I'm thinking about stats and stuff, so I'm not doing my jumps the way I'm supposed to be doing them. It's freezing? Eric, where even are you? It is not freezing. It's at least in the 70s, so there's no way it's freezing. What is it right now? It's 80. It's in the 80s. It is not freezing, Eric. And I'm dead. Okay. I just gotta get through this run. I don't even know what I was talking about a second ago. I have not gotten a single good time with that freeze laser since like 20 tries ago. Also, we're over 100 deaths, I didn't even realize. So my goal is to get sub 18 and sub, let's just say sub 100 deaths. I could go for sub 80, I guess, but sub 100 sounds better. But a PB would be sub 18, sub 80. That wasn't Eric? Oh, sorry. Looked like Eric. The the purple name. See, so you guys, the thing with Twitch is that it gives, it, it tries to give you guys different colors for your names. So usually I'm able to like glance over and look and see, okay, like who who's talking? Because I can't, if you guys think I can, uh, I can multitask enough to, uh, to play this and read chat messages directly, you're out of your mind. So I look over and I see, yeah, I see now Joe and Eric, at least for me, have the same color name. So I try to glance over at it and I saw Eric a few times and I saw purple. So I was like, oh, that must have been Eric. I just thought, and also Eric is also just insane sometimes. So it would make sense that Eric would say something like that. But, you know, whoa, that was close. Well, now we're over 20, which sucks. Okay. 20 minutes, not 20 deaths. We, that passed a long time ago. Okay, am I going to get lucky with this timing? No, I'm not. That was terrible. I also ran into the spike. I don't know why my timing is so off on that. I was doing great earlier, and now I just cannot get the timing of that consistently. Wow, I got lucky there. Eric's purple for you. Joe is green. Yeah, so that's the thing. It's not consistent among everybody. It's different for everybody, which is a problem for me. I wish there were like, s wow, that was dumb. <laughs> I wish there were like different indicators. I, I get that there's only so many colors, right? You can't have everybody in chat be a different color, but I don't know. I wish there was a different way to like glance at it and see who's talking. Maybe I just need to get good. Wow, that would have been great. I've got my timing back. Now I just can't make the jumps. Yeah, I was a little bit insane to think that first could have done this. Because this is, this is kind of ridiculous. I, I, I did not consider how hard I was actually making this. Because I kept doing things thinking like, Oh man, that's just too mean. I can't do that. So then everything else seemed nice in comparison. So you kind of get into this rhythm of creating insanely hard things thinking they're easy. When in fact, not quite. And I got frozen. I should have just st stood still. You can just stand still there uh, once once you bait those two spikes. Or those two sets of spikes. Because the platform doesn't actually force you to hit anything. So if you get frozen there after the spikes, then it's fine. So I should probably do that if I don't feel confident about making the jump. Like there. I'm going to get hit. Well, okay. If you're on the edge like that, it doesn't count. But... I'm 
get frozen? Well, I could have just stood still, but I went too far. Are we going to get a sub-30 at least? If not, I think I'll just reset the run. I know I said I was going to finish it, but... I want to get a better run going, because this is not going well. I should be able to get out of here pretty quickly, but... Not going according to... I don't know why that killed me. Not going according to plan. But see, this is the thing. Clearly, I've already spent, I think... Almost half of my time on this room. Just this room. Which makes sense. That's the whole point. Wow, I just cannot get around those now. I'm frozen on the edge. Wow, that was very close timing there. Cool. I think I kind of got lucky there. Kind of glad it froze me. Otherwise, that would have been bad timing. Okay, now we'll wait. We'll wait this time. So if we stay here, then we're, we're pretty much safe from it. And we can wait this out. Now we could go. Yep. Okay. Not bad. Now we're back here finally. Okay. I could go now. Nice. And we're back. Okay. Bait this one. Whoa, that was close. Bait it. Alright. This is D1, I believe. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Oh my god, we got lucky. Alright. Final jump is pretty hard. We made it. Okay. Done. Sweet. Yay. Alright. What was our total there? 158 deaths, 172 resets, <laughs> almost a thousand jumps. Final time, 26 minutes, 26 seconds, 700 milliseconds. 7, no, what is this? 7 milliseconds? 7 point, point 705. Well, I don't know what that is exactly. Yippee! Everybody scream E. We did it. Cheers, everybody. Welcome in, uh, Nari Nariyuka. Nariyuka, I believe is how you pronounce that. Welcome in. How you doing? Thank you for the ease. I hope I read that correctly as an R. Yes, it is. Okay, cool. All right. So, if we continue, this is where we learn if things are broken or not. Okay, you can move the camera during that, which is a little weird. The music does come back. It gets rid of my continue. Why did it get rid of my continue? Did it delete the save? It didn't delete the save, did it? That's not where the save is. Oh, the save is in uh, app data now. Hold on. App data. Let's find it. Uh, where is that? It would be in Bean Challenge, unless that's not an actual one. No, it's not. Oh wait, no, this is a full rebuild. It should be in here somewhere. Is it Epic Games apps or something? I don't remember how this works. Man, you guys were not as excited as me about finishing that because the E did not. The, the E, you guys did not scream E as much as I, I thought you guys would. Usually you guys love to scream E. Alright. Uh, where would it be? Am I just stupid? Is it not in app data? Maybe it's just not in roaming. Is it in local? Probably local. There it is. Yeah, yeah, Okay. That's that. Where's Bean Challenge? That is what it's called, right? Yeah, there it is. Okay, Bean Challenge saved. Save games. Okay, it kept my save. Why doesn't it recognize that my save exists? That's not right. Okay, I don't know why that happened, but I guess it doesn't matter for now. I'm gonna mark that down though, because that is important. Uh, so there was the the camera glitch in last room, and then there's uh, save and can't continue after complete game and then here's let's see if I quit and I join back in does it have a continue it does okay so that's weird I don't know why that does that then that doesn't make any sense that's a weird change hmm all right uh if I continue it puts us back at the beginning and continues our timer that's also not right it was supposed to stop the timer 
Can't continue after complete game. Continue after complete game starts at checkpoint one and starts timer. It's not supposed to do either of those things. If I'm right about this, if I die, no, it does add to the death counter. So it's just completely broken. Um, starts timer allows death count. Uh, I'll just put etc. Because I'm pretty sure that means it also counts the jumps and the resets, which it should not be doing. Doesn't matter though. We're going to quit out. We're going to do a new game. We'll fix that later. Let's give it a try. All right. Take two. Are you guys ready? Let's see if I can do much better this time. We'll have to see. I'd like to get a PB. I would like to be get a PB. The Capsule Rage game. That's so, so creative. So original. All right. Starting over. See if I can first try the first room, which I should be able to. I wasn't able to before, and I don't know why. Maybe I just wasn't warmed up enough yet. I think I wasn't warmed up enough yet, because this is significantly easier. Yep. 16 seconds. <laughs> Easy. Ah, uh, that was bad. I want to get that. I want. I really want to get, like, the constant curve around. There we go. You can also do it with that, but I don't like to do that. It's bit much. I messed it up there. It's really hard to get that consistently. Right, so spin around, spin around, spin around. There we go. Really hard to get that consistently. I'm sure a lot of people will be way better at that than I am in the future. But for now, I'm good with that. Already way better than we were doing before. Less than a minute to get to room three. Not bad. I want to do this skip, but I don't know. Am I am I going to get it? Let's see if I get it first try. If I don't... Yeah, okay. If I don't get it first try, we're just going to move on. It's worth a try. It's worth a try for that, but otherwise, I think it's just worth skipping. All right. Whoop. Jump around. Sorry I'm not reading chat as much right now. But it is speedrun time, gamers. I spaded that. That one's pretty easy. Yeah, see, it saves a lot of time if you can get the skip, but otherwise... Not so much. There we go. And this one, this one I usually try to bait, but I think that's just easier to run past it. All right, cool. This one you kind of have to go top down for. Wow, that was way too close on that. All right, there we go. Laser time. Sub two. Sub two for lasers. If I can get this in one go again, that would be great. I don't know if I have the right timing for it, though. Ooh, that's close. Nope, I don't have the right timing for it right now. Yep. Okay, not in one. Not in one that time. Yeah, Joe's yellow now. What happened? Joe, Joe changed colors magically. Congratulations, I think, Joe. I like how Maker is, like, always green. Andres is always blue. Eric is usually always purple. Joe changes. Joe breaks the space-time continuum, somehow. Time-space continuum? What is it? What's the phrase? I don't know. Doesn't matter. Whoa. Oh, I could have jumped that. Whoops. Kate's always pink. Rose is always pink. But Rose always has badges by her name. Alright, let's... Let, whoa. Hello, camera. Okay, that was bad timing over there. Boom. I don't know why I tried to jump that. Thank you for whatever that was. I need different notification sounds because I can't see that right now. But thank you, whoever that was. That might have been on YouTube too. I haven't turned those off yet. Okay. I'm assuming that was on YouTube because I would have seen it. No, nope, nope, it wasn't. Thank you for following. <laughs> thank you. Uh, th uh, thank you, uh, Nari Nariyuka. I've got to re remember that now. i got to relearn how to say names. Because sometimes you guys have easy names, like Kate. Sometimes you guys have complicated names, like Nariyuka. Which is going to take me some getting used to, but bear with me. Thank you for following. Appreciate it. Oh, well, I'm just messing up. <laughs> Yay, yellow. Congratulations, Joe. Okay, wow, I cannot get around that corner now. We might mess this up just because of this room. Wow, why am I, why am I suddenly bad at getting around that corner. Probably because my nose is itchy now and I'm trying to scratch it more. 
There we go. Back here. Also, you can probably tell that we changed a little bit of the floor in this room. Like, there's way less just freestanding spikes. Whoa, that was too close for comfort. And I'm... I sh shouldn't have reset there. I just... <laughs> that was that was just dumb of me overall. And that was a terrible error, but it's fine. Oh, this is bad timing, I think. No, it's not. It's good timing. Bad timing. Never mind, I lied. Okay, if you don't get timing on the first go, you are so screwed here. Wow. Keep brainstorming names in chat, by the way, guys, because I need uh, I need a name for this before this releases on itch. That I can't see what that is. Hold on, that was that was bits, was it? Thank you for the bits. I appreciate it. Thank you for the ten bits. I need to relearn. I one thing we'll we'll do for a stream here eventually, because I didn't do it during my uh, designing my new stream layout stream is uh, resetting all the sound alerts. Because right now it's all the jump scare sounds still, and I only want some of them to be the jump scare sounds the rest of them i want to be like well they can still be jump scares but i want them to be like other alert sounds so i'll probably just scream into my microphone a few times one of these days give myself a couple new uh a couple new <laughs> jesus christ yeah jump scares exactly exactly like that congratulations you're, you're so right you know what i'm talking about you guys are like you guys are like small children that like when something happens you're like, oh, you mean like this? And then they just do something random that's kind of related to it. Sometimes it's completely unrelated to it. At least you guys are like, you guys are like toddlers. Right? You're old enough to understand context. So you guys, you guys fit in with the context of the situation. So it's like, I say jump scares and then everybody's like, jump scares. Oh, you mean like this? And then you just go out like crazy on jump scares. You know, it, it's fitting. So, you know, instead of... Instead of calling you guys beans, I'm gonna start calling you guys toddlers. That's that's much more fitting <laughs> universal code. See, that one didn't get me though, because you guys you can't do it back to back. See, that's the problem. If you try to do it back to back, it doesn't work. Because then I like I I'm still recovering. Rec recovering isn't the right term, but you know I'm like I'm still used to the fact that I got jump scared, so I'm like expecting it now, even though I'm not expecting it. But it's less effective. But I don't know the science behind it, but you get the point. Anyways, I just went on a rant there trying to do this because it's kind of, it is muscle memory in a way right now because I'm just kind of spewing words out and it's working, but I'm just, I'm just saying random words and relying on my muscle memory to do the rest for me. See, like that. Okay, now I wait for these to cross. Then I drop and I go here. And now is this going to go back? No, it's not. Okay. <laughs> that was almost bad timing. What is bro yapping about? Well, if you can't understand it, it probably wasn't that important anyway, so. And there goes that. <laughs> that is definitely one of my most common places to die. Which is surprising because I was going to say everybody else, but the only other two people who've gotten that far, which I don't even know. Yeah, Jacob has gotten that far, hasn't he? I think he has. Yeah, he definitely has. Um, the only other two people who've done this and beaten it would be Jacob and Andres. And both of them, I believe, got that first try. And I very rarely actually get it first try. All right. Whoop. There we go. Got it. Just reset there for uh, convenience sake and mess it up. So we'll just do it again. That's fine. All right. Now the room that killed me a ton last time. Hey, Flavius. Welcome in. I did not see that. Maybe your next game could use the Game Jolt API to have better achievements. Uh, yeah. So I thought about that. I don't know how to uh, incorporate it into Unreal. I wanted to do that last time, but also this game won't have achievements and it's going to go up on Steam eventually, so I won't really work with that. But next time I upload on Game Jolt with achievements, I'll look into it more. The only problem is that I was doing it for Game Jolt and Itch.io, so I can't really use that. And so far my preference, like I can't use it exclusively, so far my preference is Itch.io, but, you know, I don't know. Given more time. We'll see. Wow, did I just nail this room? Wow. That was significantly faster than the last time. I think I was already to like at least 10 minutes. I don't know. Where was I last time? I think it was at least to 10 minutes at this point. I think just shutting my brain off and just spewing, just yapping random nonsense is the solution here. Well, that, was, that could have been good if I didn't wrap it too aggressively. Nice. 
Nail it on your first try and won't ever do it again, I'm sure. <laughs> Probably not. It is one of those things that if you get lucky the first try, save, hold on to that. Go to Vegas immediately. <laughs> Have inbuilt Twitch commands to check and screw with streamers. Yes, I saw that in the suggestions and I absolutely want to do that. I know there's a method to do that. I, well, that was terrible. Uh, I don't know how to do it yet, but I'm definitely going to try to do that. Because I think that'd be hilarious. You can turn on Twitch integration and then use that to make your life even more miserable. Well. Yeah, if you guys aren't in the Discord, join the Discord, uh, because there is where you guys can input your suggestions and stuff. There, I'll actually see them, because usually during streams, if you guys drop stuff in, it's like, oh, that's a cool idea, but then I'll forget it by the end of stream, or I won't even see it in the first place. So, if you want that, like, if you have a suggestion you want to you wanna give me, I don't know why those are bugging out again um make sure to leave it in the rage game suggestions in the discord because that is a specific channel now <laughs> thank you eric for quadruple the... a <laughs> the... quadruple a thank you eric for the 39 bits for the new uh type of battery coming out 2025 wow that was terrible that may be the worst i've done there i don't think i've ever gotten hit there by that laser <coughs> oh, excuse me. My nose is starting to go now. Uh-oh. Whoops. I am number one now by one bit. Congratulations, Eric. Big preach for the bits. I wish blurp bits counted towards that because uh, people who 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 get blurps um i don't think i don't think they get recognized and that's definitely the most fun way to use bits at least in my mind is to to play random sound effects uh oh bad timing just stay here okay i could have made it but just in case I really want this timing to line up. Getting the timing here, very challenging. If I didn't freeze there, I probably would have made it. <laughs> thank you for the uh, for, thank you for the forty bits. As Ghost <laughs> Eric Sanders, I'm sorry, Eric. <laughs> Is this a bits challenge now? See who can be the bet. Wow! I after all of that waiting, I still messed up. This is now a bits competition. Who can who can give the most bits? Find out next time on. This idiot plays his own game. Okay, now I can make that. Good. I think if I have to wait, I should just kind of say screw it and not. Because then I throw myself off with timing. Oh, I could have made it. Let's try it now. Oh, okay. Made that. Let's see if I can do it this rhyme. Th this rhyme? This time. Around. Okay. Okay. Now I wait for that to go backwards. I think we're going to make this. No! Last jump! That last jump sucks so much. It's the worst jump in the game. It's the one of the longest jumps in the game with spikes around it. So if you even miss it slightly, like you can't really hang on the edge on that one because of the spikes unless you get it dead center, which is not an easy task. That would have been a great time too. Whoops. It's all right. Whoop. Oh my god, Eric, the 12 bits. Thank you, I appreciate it. <laughs> Please spare me. Oh, poor Eric. Eric, why why do you want to be number one so bad? Is there a, a self-confidence issue there? Are you. I should not have done that. That was dumb with me. Trying to compensate for something. Is something going on? It's alright, Eric. It's okay. You can, you, you can talk to us. <laughs> yes, there is. I, yeah. Alright, that, that makes sense. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm doing, I'm doing not good right right now. I am, I got there, I saw the light, and then my whole life flashed before my eyes. And now I'll never do it again. Wow, this is, this is not, this is going not well. Can I please... 
I'm not locked in anymore, gamers. I've, I've locked out. I've locked out. It's not going well. My brain isn't working at full capacity anymore. Okay. Wait for that laser to get out of the way. I don't want to freeze midair. Alright. Come on. Oh, it froze me too far over. Oh, that sucked. I know I could get a much better time than that. Like, I could I could get a 12-minute time. Just, whoa, wow, I dodged that barely. That was by random chance that I dodged that. Okay, there we go. Landed in a good spot for that. I'll take that. Now it's going to go up. Ah, why did I do that? You kind of do have to go around slightly unless you go early. It's a very difficult... That is a very difficult jump. It is the first technically, like, two-block jump... And I froze there. God. Uh, even though it's really only one and a half, it does look like a two block. So it, it's definitely one of the hardest jumps to, like, gauge your p correct positioning for in the game. But other than that, it's not the worst jump. It's just a matter of perspective on it. Which is uh, really hard to get. In wow, well, well, especially when that happens. It's kind of impossible to get when that happens. <sighs> Jesus. I'd like to stop freezing. I really want to get a sub-18 this time. I got a, what, 22 last time? I don't want proof of it, because I know you guys are only relying on what I said that I got a sub-18. So right now, the best you guys have seen is... Wow, I keep doing the same thing. Uh, it's 22 minutes and like 125 deaths or something, whatever it was. I still have a chance to get sub-18 and sub 80, but it's pretty unlikely at this point. I mean, I was literally right there. Ah, oh, that was just too far. That was dumb of me. Oh, got really lucky there. All right, come on. Uh oh, nope, I made it. Oh God, why do I keep doing that? And there's 80 deaths. All right, not sub 80. Still get sub-18, potentially. Well, not if I keep doing that. Ever since... I swear, ever since I got there. I got there that one time, and now I have not been able to do it since. And that hit me on the swing back. I came back around to make sure I didn't hit the other spikes. Oh, I don't think I'm going to get it this time. I could still get better than the last run, but I don't think I'm going to get it this time. It sucks, because, yeah, I got here in, what, eight minutes? It's been another ten minutes, almost. Just in this room. That's how terrible this room is. This room will kill any run. I can't wait to see somebody do this deathless. Someone, I know someone's probably bound to do it. For every game out there, someone does something crazy with it. I can't wait to see a single deathless. That would just be insanity. It's probably near impossible to get, just because of how easy it is to slip up. But I guess, I mean, you practice it for hundreds of hours, then it's fine. It's probably a cakewalk, but... Oh my god, I don't know how that didn't hit me. That was not English, but I tried. Uh, I don't think this is the... I don't think this is the one. Yeah, no, it's 18. Alright, we're not even gonna... We're not gonna finish it. We're just gonna start a new one. Why does it... See, why does it do that when I hit Rage Quit? Alright, well, here we go. And we're off to a bad start. Let's uh, start over. Why does it do that? Why does it show that? I don't get that. It shouldn't be doing that. Also, why can't I get this first jump now? Thank you. I got this in a 16 second. I got, I got this 16 seconds last time. Nope. It's better for me right there. Oh, I know why it's doing it. It's not hiding it when it creates it. That's annoying. Wow, I cannot get this first area. Come on. All right. There we go. There we go. 
Nice, not bad. Alright, 16. 16 seems to be about the usual on that, if I can get it quickly. I would consider giving a reward if someone did a three minute death list. I would love to. I'm broke. Uh, my dad was trying to convince me to do like a hundred dollar reward or something, which the reason he points that out is because I said that for first. Like, hey, if, if first gets this, then I will give him a hundred bucks. And the reason I said that is because I knew it wasn't going to happen. There was, there was no shot he was going to be able to beat the game in like four hours. He didn't even get out of the first room until like after four hours. So, yeah, there was no way. But I know Maker is willing to put in the time, so Maker's probably the only one who could, or would be willing to at least, but, I don't know. I'll have to think about it. I might have to wait until the, uh, until the full game is out, because then I can at least make some of that back if I were to put a reward on the line. And it would be something for, like, during the full game, but, I don't know, we'll see. All right, let's see if I can speed run this faster, and then we should get back to development after this. I think this, if this one isn't a PB, then we'll come back to that later. But I do want to fix some things, potentially come up with a better name, and go from there. Also, maybe I'll try this with controller, because I am terrible at this game with controller. I'm great with mouse and keyboard. I think controller is absurd with this. Oof, that was just bad. Okay, if we can get through the laser room quicker, then this will go a lot better. That was just dumb of me. Let's pause. Let me take my, my flannel off. This is really hot. I vote Angie Little Pill. I read that as Angie, unironically. Like, I legitimately thought that said Angie. It just said angry. Hydrate? I got you, Eric. Cheers, I'm gonna hydrate with real water this time. Cheers, everybody. Alright. Here we go. $30 and I'm locked in. See, Maker, for now, do it for the fun of it, because when the full game comes out, it'd probably be more than uh, just 30 bucks. Okay, bad timing on that. Whoops. Oh yeah, Chip for Andres is still a thing. I forgot, uh, I forgot to take that off because Andres has his own stream now. So, get your chips for Andres out while you can, because that will go away as soon as I remember to do it at a different stream, or later in the stream, or whatever. But, uh, now's your last chance to get your chips for Andres on my stream. After that, you'll have to go watch Andres stream to be able to force him to eat more chips. Because I believe there is a chip redeem, if I'm not mistaken, on his stream because of this chaos that we've created. I missed that jump. Why did I think that was going to make it? I did not think that was going to make it. Oh, I'm really lucky that one made it. Whew. Last Planet Vano chips. Yeah, last chips at the Planet Vano Cafe, which is not what this stream... It, um, oh, wow, I got lucky there. Nice. Alright, assuming I can get this... Yep. Cool. Alright, checkpoint reached. Good thing, because I missed those jumps. Oh, my nose will not stop itching now. This is terrible. Oh, it's cheaper on yours. I thought it was more expensive over there. Ugh. Okay. Okay. And I'm dead. <laughs> Well, I kind of locked in for that one, but my nose will not stop bothering me now. That happens every stream. I think it, it definitely has to do with me speaking because of my nasal resonance of my voice for whatever reason. It vibrates a lot in my nose. All right, hold on. All 
and my nose vibrating when I speak uh, causes uh, causes nose problems that uh, specifically itches, lots of itches. Okay, can I can I please get through this area? Also, I think I wanted to change the angle of this checkpoint. Maybe not. I think I tried that. Maybe maybe that's not correct. Okay, oh my god, here comes all the chips. I'm sorry, Andres, I think. But also chips, so, you know, sustenance, very important. What hit me? Did a laser hit me? I think a laser hit me there. Why am I so bad at this part all of a sudden? It's because I'm not, I'm not locked in. I need to lock in. And I did not lock in for that jump. That was the most, like, small, slow, depressing fall ever. Lunar, have you just been saving up, like, a million points just to spend on Andres chips? Andres, you're gonna have to eat, like, a whole bag at this point. Might as well just get a bag ready. I also love how you guys are just trusting that fact that Andres is actually eating chips. Because it, there's, there's no, there's no law, there's no proof, unless he's proving it in the Discord or something, but... You guys are just kind of trusting that he will deliver on his promise. Okay, well, we made it to this checkpoint. Five minutes, not bad. I don't know if we did this well last time or not. I can't remember. I don't know why I bothered with that again. Wee. Right. <laughs> well, that was just terrible. Let's see if we can't get rid of this room quickly. So if I can get this room done sub... Let's just say eight. Then we're in a good spot for the next room. I can see a hair hanging down my glasses. That's really annoying. Not helping me game here. Really not helping me. Kind of distracting. Good God. Are you just going to spend all your points on chip? That's a lot of points. I don't, I don't know if you guys realize how much time it takes to get to a thousand points. It's like two hours, isn't it? There's no, like, two hours to get a thousand points. I mean, I guess if you're subscribed, it's different, but even then, it's still, like, it doesn't boost you that much. Oh, why did I do this? That was bad timing. Oh my god, the hair is killing me. The nose itch is just really destroying me right now. This, man, not helping. What was that? I looked down at the timer when I made that jump. Why did I do that? This room started to kill Andres. Uh, killed Jacob. But Andres uh, persevered. I don't know if Jacob did. I haven't seen Jacob beat it yet. Oh my god. Oh my itchy nose was not helping. I don't know if we get this this time. Wow. Okay, that was definitely not the one. Okay. Right. Wow. E might be the best redeem, but I'm pretty sure Chip is the second most spent redeem in my channel. Probably at this point. Well, Hydrate actually is still probably the highest because of you, specifically. Well, I'm dead. Yeah, I'm not there. Sub 8. That sucks. I could still probably do it fine with sub 10, but still, I'm not even close yet. I'm dead. That sucked. Worst timing. What did I do for hydrate? Not you. Not you, Andres. Maker. Maker killed the hydrate. Oh my god, my nose. Oh my nose. Wow. So here's the thing too. I, I know you guys are just itching to get your hands on this game. Uh, I removed all the prototype builds because I don't I don't want you guys to be able to do it yet because the full release is coming very soon. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make the video about how I made this game in a week. Uh, I'm gonna release that video and then I'm going to release the, like I'm gonna release the game and the video simultaneously. So within the next week. But I was thinking about it earlier, I was like, I should just release the game already because everybody wants it. But the problem with that is that drives no traction to my channel because there's no video related to it yet. 
So if I save that for once the video is done and I release them at the same time, if some big YouTuber or something gets their hands on the game and plays it, then at least any traction that goes to the game also goes to my channel. And that's how I've thought about all of my game releases, other than Bark, which wasn't meant for that. Um, every game that I've done other than that, uh, like Bean Game, Thankmas Game, and Lixian Game, I have released simultaneously with the video. So that way, all traction from from the video goes to the game, and all traction from the game goes to the video. So that way they're all connected, and anybody who sees it will be able to find my stuff. And I'm frozen. Uh, ooh, okay, man, I'm dead. Alright. Well. And we're not sub-10 anymore, I don't think this is the one. We're gonna keep going until 18, if we don't get it, then screw it, we'll come back to it. Wow. Well, I just ran into that spike. That was terrible. A demo build before the full release, same time as the video. That's what I'm... Yes, that's, that's what I just said. <laughs> was that not clear? Yes, the full release is not coming anytime soon. The This is going to be the demo that gets released on Game Jolt and Itch.io um, when the video comes out. That's that's what this is. Then the full release, of course, is going to get its own game, but I'm also going to try to do devlogs for the game as I go. So, like, each time I add something leading up to the full release, I'll make a video about it. So that'll build hype around, you know, wishlist the game now. But for now, it's, uh, it's this. It's just going to be the demo. Which I was thinking, do I make a different thing for the demo, but I think this is very fitting for the demo of the full game. Because I know what I'm going to do for the full game, and it's going to be a lot different than just this. This is basically going to be, like, one of the final challenges in the full game. I don't know if I'll include this as, like, one of the final challenges, and I might. But also, since it's the demo, maybe this will be, like, the tutorial? The, the, like, the end of the tutorial challenges? Which, you know, actually, now that I think about it, that might be a good idea. To set, like, the tutorial is, like, a series of levels, right? In the full release. I just hit that on accident. The The tutorial will be, like, a series of, like, let's just say five levels leading up to this. And then this will be the tutorial finale. And then from there, we'll build off of that. So that way the demo is still used and connected in the full game. Because I could just build, like all brand new levels for the full game, but this was a lot of work, and this being one of the levels in the full game, I would want. The tutorial? <laughs> yes, exactly. This is the tutorial. This is, this is the easy part. This is me showing off that, hey, look, this game's hard, but we're just getting started, you know? And we're dead. I don't think this is the one. It does not seem, unless I just nail that next room on the first try, it does not seem like this is going to be the one, gamers. I hate to break it to you all, but this is significantly worse than I've done in the past, and I think it's all thanks to my nose vibrating nonstop. I don't know what is causing that, but I cannot stop. Ow. I say tutorial? Yeah, I know, that's, that's, yeah, that's how I say it. <laughs> I don't see the problem. I know you guys are just so dirty-minded you can't possibly think of it just being the way that I say a word, but... I mean... Yeah. What am I supposed to say? Tutorial? Tutorial? Because it's it, it would technically be tutorial, but I say it faster than that. Also, is my light not working? Because I feel like I look really red. Maybe it's just... It's all the orange in the level. That's it. And I'm frozen. Yeah, this isn't going to be the one. Tutorial? It is not tutorial. This is so, uh, so aggressive. Tutorial? What, are you having two tutorials at the same time? Tutorial is like the character from Undertale. Like that doesn't, that doesn't make sense. It, it would be tutorial based on the spelling. The English language sucks, man. You can't do that very well. That's not an easy trick to do. 
I guess if you did that, but yeah, didn't trigger it. My nose is so itchy beyond anything right now, guys. You have no idea. This is this is killing me. All right, this is this is not gonna be the one. Hundred percent. We have four minutes left, but this is not the one. I don't know how I did so much better last time versus this one, but this is not. This is not going. Not going well. I'm dead because of the freeze laser. Good job. Well, that was bad. You can spell it out for me. Well, here's the thing. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. You can spell it out in the International uh, Phonetic Alphabet all you want, okay? It's not going to help me. One, because I can't read it. But also, because it doesn't matter. It's not going to change the way that I say it. Because I'm still going to say tutorial. See, I don't even... I don't say tutorial. I say tutorial. I just skip the U. I literally just skip the U when I say it. I don't know. Lunar's still going out on the chips. Going crazy about the chips. Lunar's giving you one chip per rat right now. Is this going to be the one, finally? After like 10 minutes of attempts, am I finally going to get this? Unless I get bad freeze RNG. Yep. It's not even RNG. It's just bad timing. It and I'm dead. Make every linguist and and uh, phone phoneticist. I didn't even know that was a word. Phoneticist. Jesus Christ, the English language sucks so much. I make them all angry. I hope so. They don't. They don't deserve any. They don't deserve love. <laughs> they make our language too hard to understand. Somehow I'm now getting here consistently again. I think it's because I locked back in. Not that I even really locked out before. Okay, this is the one. Cool. I'm cool with that. Uh, except it's now 17 minutes, so if I don't get this in the next minute, well, we just... Well... I don't think this is going to be the one, gamers. Hate to break it to you, but we finally made some progress. And we're here at about 80 deaths. Still sub-18, but just barely. And now it's 80 deaths, so that one's gone. There's still a chance, though, with the uh, 18 minutes. Pfft, well, see, the thing that sucks the most is I had a chance at a 12-minute run. And I completely squandered it. Like, I was so... I was literally one jump away from a 12-minute run. Which would have been incredible. And it just didn't, didn't happen. Well, so much for sub-18. That time has uh, passed here. Oh, I got really lucky on that. Oh my god, I got really lucky on that too. The grabbing of the capsule is so insane to me. I missed it. Wow, that could have been the one too. Would have been a much better run than before. Still wouldn't have been a sub-18, but it would have been significantly better than before. There's still potential for that, but I don't think we're going to make it this time. No. It's not. I don't even think we're going we're gonna to finish this run. It doesn't really matter. We got a better run. We didn't get... Well, we, not a better run. We, we did get a really good run. I would say sub-30 is really good in this game. But we didn't... Well, that was bad timing. We did not get a sub-18 yet. I may try again later. But since I almost got a, a sub-13, like since I almost got a 12-minute run, I would say I did pretty dang good here. I don't know why I just jumped in that. Make a custom map builder. I would love to, but I know that's going to be extremely difficult. 
because of the way that you have to group polygons together and I'm not doing that really in a custom enough way. I mean, I guess one thing, if I can figure out how to tap into Unreal's built-in... Oh, those are shaking now. That's interesting. Uh, if I can tap into Unreal's built-in uh, BSP editor and use that in-game, then I absolutely will. If not, then it may not be a thing I can do. I also don't know how to work with Steam's Workshop, so I don't know how I would share levels online. That's just dumb. Yeah, if, once we hit 100 deaths here, we'll just stop. And there it is. All right, 100 deaths. Whatever. It's fine. Let's get back to work on it, though. Never mind. Why did, okay, so that's the first thing. I gotta stop that from popping up. That'll be an easy fix, but okay. So... I don't know, I just said like four words, four, four different, I started four different sentences there. I don't know where I was going with that, but that's the wrong bean game. That's the, uh, that's wrong bean game. Wrong bean game. Not this bean game. We're not talking about this bean game today. That's not the bean game. My nose will not stop killing me. Is there a way that you can turn the tiny grid inside the cubes off, or is it supposed to be d distracting? It's not supposed to be distracting. That is a good point, though. We brought we have the f save my bitrate option that we didn't try out, and we're going to have to try that out later, um, which kind of does that. It kind of does the opposite, but it's not meant to be distracting. It's just it, that's the aesthetic of the game, but, you know. Why do you hate tutorial so much? That's just how I say the word. I don't see a problem with the way that I say my words. <laughs> Did I even open the other one? I just opened. God, I, I don't know why I'm suffering right now. It's my nose. I blame my nose 100%. I also blame you guys. It's your guys' fault. <laughs> okay, get your final chips out. I am turning off the chip redeem in... Uh, let's go to... Here we go. All right. In five... Four, three, two, one. Final chips. Goodbye, chip redeem. There it goes. No more chip. There are no more chip opportunities. <laughs> Congratulations, gamers. For all the chips that you sent to Andres. I'm sure he's very appreciative. Okay, I guess I could open it through there. Cool. That works. <laughs> <laughs> boo. <laughs> yes, boo for no more chips. Of course. Oh, my! No I gotta take care of my nose. Give me a second. The best I can do is blow my nose. I don't know what I can do to, like, completely fix my nose. So it's really hot now. The heat kicked up like a lot in the past hour. Okay. <sighs> Loader scaring me. Okay. What we need to do first is fix this. When the main menu shows, the confirm menu is covering it for some reason. And I think it's because... When we hit continue or new, it's not setting it to collapsed. Open confirm, close confirm. When we hit close confirm, then it's doing this. Otherwise, can I just custom or custom event um, force close uh, confirm? Because if I hydration, I missed a hydrate. All right. Oh, here you go, Kate. Cheers. Bad timing. <sighs> I missed that when I was blowing my nose, but cheers, everybody. Make sure you guys stay hydrated. You guys know the deal. All right, so when we force close, uh, we can we can do that here. Whenever we do... I guess just on, just on continue, we will... Force, close, confirm. Actually, no, not, not there. We will do that when we open the main menu. So in here, hide main menu or no, show main. Okay, so fine. In here, when we show main menu, we are going to 
ignore this. We're going to confirm, confirm menu, and then we're going to force close every time we open this. And that will take care of that for us. This is not the best way to work with menus. Uh, I realize that now, but that's that's just how it is now. Okay, it's fine for this. It's fine for this game because it's small. All right, so if I wait, no, now the other problem. If we complete the game and then we try to continue, the continue button doesn't exist. We didn't fix that, did we? We tried this with the. Oh wait, no, we have a alternate version of that. Uh, so in here, uh, that was only happening on, which one was that happening on? From pause or no has save. Okay. So here, when we complete the game, so that needs to be on the win state on win state. Hello. Hi. Why? What's up? Do you want me to mute? Yeah. Okay. Give me a second gamers. I'll be back. Enjoy the music. Alright, father had mystery music playing in his headphones um, that are Bluetooth paired to uh, his phone and we checked his phone and there was nothing there was no app open on his phone that could have been playing any music. So that's a mystery. Don't know why that happened. We solved it by playing something else and it just stopped it. But there was just a random music playlist playing in his earbuds miraculously. We didn't even really recognize the playlist. Like it wasn't a playlist that he created. That was that was weird. I don't know why that happened. It might come back. <laughs> I don't know if that permanently solved it, but that happened. Anyways, what were we doing? We were uh, doing something here, trying to force the main menu shut. We were gonna test it, I think. Is all. It was your playlist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys did this. Okay. Pause the coconut mall for a second. Um, oh, I don't have a way to test this. I have to skip to the end. Okay, that's fine. So if I take the player quick spawn at the end, I believe it's still there. 
I can new game, confirm start over, go through this. It should show us at the end. I was listening in the basement. Of course you were. Thank you. I don't have a basement. I, just for you, just so you guys know, there there is no basement. Okay, continue. And we get set back here, and now it should give me a continue. It puts me back here. Pauses my timer. Stops my deaths. Nope, it still counts deaths. Because it turns off that it's complete. Of course, of course, of course, of course. Uh, I didn't do the other part of it. That was in here, not in here. Uh, in the win menu, here, that tells it when we end that we know we have a save. Force no has save. That's also helpful. Happened to me sometimes, just accidentally play and close something and it doesn't stop, half the time at least. The other half is just your average demonic activity. Well, here's the thing. He hasn't used that for a long time. And he hasn't had music playing from his phone for a long time, as far as I know. At least not that playlist. Like, I don't know what that music came from. So it could have been could have been our neighbors. Who knows? I don't know. Let's sit and drink monster and watch stream in the attic there's no attic either it's a crawl space there's a crawl space below and a crawl space above i don't know how you guys are fitting in there but enjoy i guess okay uh so that's fine there but we also need to tell it because it tells it complete is it is not true but i want that to be true still so now if i play and i hit continue it's still adding deaths it's still started the timer it's because it's not saving that it's complete. That's another problem. Okay. So in the save game for level data, we need a new variable. Let's save everything first. And the new variable, this is going to be complete. Okay. Save that. And now close this. Don't save all these changes. And now go back in. I don't know why that's necessary, but it is. Welcome in, Harry Gavage. How you go? How's it going? All right. So now, theoretically, this should be fine. If you want to make a MAO editor, I don't know what that is. It's just asking Cabbage about it. Um, I'm assuming you mean like just an in-game editor. Because uh, here's the thing about this. It's it's very simplistic. I was going to try to do it like Minecraft-esque map editor, where it's like face-by-face, uh, -face because I want you to be able to like paint things potentially. Uh, or change colors. Of the, I don't know. We're going to see about that. But if I can just use the BSP thing, because I'm using BSPs normally. So if I could just tap into BSPs for the level editor system, which was coming way later. This is not anywhere close to now. Um, then that would probably be how I'd want to do it is with uh, BSP editing. Just because that would be way easier than trying to draw faces individually. And I'm not using C++. So, you know. All right. Um, if I play from here, uh, I need to define that we are saving this. So now when we save level, which is in here, not sure using BSB would be possible without a lot of C++. Possibly. I don't know. I think if I just spawn one, I might be able to tweak it with blueprint. I'm not sure. It's a BSP maker, and it's it's box brushes. It's it's these, these instead of using static meshes, it's box brushes, just because it's easier to work with. And I could translate them to static meshes, but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna do that. This le the the levels are small enough. All of these are individual static meshes that are cold, so it's it's fine. All right. Write in C++ to undisappoint him. I am not writing in C++. It's not happening. I am not touching the nightmare of C++. Okay, in here when we save level, save current level, I now need to add whether or not we've complete the level. And then when I load the current level... <laughs> thank you, thank you, Nari, for the... Uh, uh, can I call you Nari? Is that alright? Because I, I'm, I'm going to keep struggling to say it if I don't. Uh, thank you for the 10 bits. I appreciate it. Welcome back to the top. I believe you're now at the top again. Congratulations. <laughs> you're not that guy. Trust me. Oh, Eric, you're not that guy. You are not that guy. All right, now when I load... Where is that? 
Load level. Do I not have load level in here? What am I doing? How am I loading the level? Am I only, am I doing that elsewhere? Am I just doing that elsewhere? Jesus Christ, Eric. Thank you for the extra 10 bits. I appreciate it. Eric went and bought more bits, I guess. Dare you to turn chip redeem back on. It's going to take a bit more than just daring me. Because I kind of feel a little bit bad for, uh, for Andres at this point, you know? Okay, uh, Jesus Christ, you guys are just gonna battle this out forever. Thank you for the 12 bits. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, where is this happening? When I, it's gotta be happening in the menu, probably. This is a mess. Uh, we're loading. Where am I loading the, there's a function for this somewhere. It's in here. Load level. There it is. Okay. But then it puts it like this, so that's fine. Ah! Jesus, there was a combo of, of two. Twelve, please? There was a combo of the jump scare and the bits at the same time. Congratulations. Thank you for the 12 bits. <laughs> I do not turn it back on, I swear. Now Lunar and Andreas are going to have to fight over whether or not bits come back. Alright, so there's the level save here. Save settings. Fine. Save level is here. We add it like this, and we load it. When we load it, where am I getting the information? So I load the level. Where am I retrieving this? Is there a load level function here? I literally don't remember where I put this. It's not in here. <laughs> oh my god, thank you for the 27 bits. There you go, Eric. Beat that one. Okay, never mind. You matched it, I guess. Congratulations, Eric. You're ahead of the game here. Jesus. Yeah, everybody just keep spamming Big Preach. You guys know the deal. Big Preach, Big Preach. All right. Uh, where is where is the save? You guys are lo watching me lose my mind as you just drop some bits here and there. Just drop bits in the. I'm I'm like I'm I'm a homeless person with the cup. Just like, can you spare any bits as I struggle to figure out what is wrong here? Okay, where am I loading the game? It's got to be, okay, spawn. It's not loading on spawn because that's also on respawn. <laughs> I have no more you win, Eric. Congratulations, Eric. Is Eric the number one bit holder right now? I don't know where to see that. It's down here, isn't it? Uh, top subs, top gifteds, cheers. There we go. All time is, is still Andres holding the record. Uh, this month is Eric. Congratulations. By one bit. By one bit you won. Congratulations. Alright. Let's, uh... This... It, this is being run somewhere and I don't know where. Is it here? <laughs> Jesus. God. Okay. Congratulations. You, you did it. Good job. Uh, where... Am I just an idiot? Is it... It's gotta be in the menu. It's gotta be in the menu. In here, we do this. Start timer. Load level. There it is. Jesus Christ. Okay, so it's just here. This is one of the worst possible ways I could have done this. Alright. But it's fine. Set complete. We're gonna basically... Component? What am I saying? complete. We're basically going to overhaul this entirely once I start working on the full release. This is just for the demo version because this is just chaos. This is a nightmare. Okay, that's it there. Sets complete to false there. Sets complete to false here, which is not what it should do. And there we go. Okay, so now it'll save that. So if I delete my save and then I use the quick spawn then we'll new game let's let's get a death okay one death a couple jumps a couple resets and a timer okay and then when our timer stops we get in here then one three three time continue sets us back here but now if I hit continue again time has not started I can't restart, which is a problem. I can die, but it doesn't add the counter, so I still I can't restart. Why? 
Uh, that's something in the player... No, it's something in the player controller. Respawn. If it's not completed spawns, that's why. Why did I do that there? What am I doing? That's stupid of me. No, this needs to happen. Only... Oh, wait. Pfft. It's literally already doing it. Why did I do it twice? There. That's fine. So now, I can respawn. The timer's going again. So it starts timer, but it only needs to start timer if... Okay, that's why right here. Uh, if it's complete... Wait. So it needs to load level before it does either of these. Okay, there we go. Uh, it needs to check... Uh, load level. So this needs to all come afterwards. Oh, Jesus Christ. All right. It's just a mess of wires right here. Good God. Can we get this out of the way, please? There we go. So it only create that if that's necessary. Okay. I do game save load in the game instance. Yeah, that's probably where I'll do it. But the 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 concern for me is that I'm potentially going to do this in multiplayer. I'm going to potentially add multiplayer to this. And I don't know where the best place to run things for multiplayer is because I've never done multiplayer stuff. Like, I've, I've dabbled in a little bit, so I understand tiny bits of it. But for the most part, I don't know much. Um... So that's why I've been setting up stuff in the player controller uh, and like accessing it as uh, as the controlled pawn rather than get player controller zero like I normally would. But I don't really know how it works that much. So I think I'm assuming uh, as far as I know game instance is just the instance of the game on the individual client. So I'm not worried about running stuff in there. That's why there's still a bunch of stuff going on in there. But that's probably where I'll handle it later. Because, I mean, that is actually where I'm handling it here. It's just I'm doing it here because it was convenient before. Okay, this can get disconnected. This can connect over here. We only start timer here. I will bring this down like that. Cool. Bring Chip Redeem back, be please. Spamming it is how I wanted to mourn the loss of my rad Daisy. Oh my god. Well, you can't guilt trip me into bringing it back, but you can e-spam. Do consider, do consider the e-spam. Totally worth it. Okay, we're gonna load level, and then we'll check if it's complete or not. Jesus Christ, Maker. <laughs> Thank you for the hundred bits. Entertain I me. Say something funny. Uh, something funny. Ha 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 ha. Why did the chicken cross the road? Uh, because he's a chicken. Ha 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 ha. Is that, is that good? Did I, did I get you? Did I get you? How many eggs can you fit in an egg? Like 40. Maybe. <laughs> you know? Hilarious. That's what you guys come here for, the the quality content of me being just oh so hilarious, you know? Obviously. Alright, so this is only gonna do... It's gonna set, can move, it's gonna spawn us no matter what. It's gonna do that no matter what. And then it's only going to start the timer if the game's complete. God, this is a mess right here. But it'll work. And that's what matters. If it's not complete, we'll start the timer. There we go. Oh, that's a mess. That is a huge mess right there. But it's fine. Okay, Jesus Christ. I can never keep anything, I guess. Oh, poor Eric. Yeah, Maker, why'd you have to do that to Eric? Poor Eric. Okay. Oh, cheered 420. Why does it show... Oh, because it reads like that. That's annoying to me. Thank you for the 420 bits. I appreciate it. I didn't read that correctly. Thank you. <laughs> I need to learn how to read notifications on Twitch because I'm still not really used to the way that it displays. Alright, so now it knows it's complete. So now... Okay, timer did not start. <laughs> you pee era 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 my money a... Thank you, Eric, for the 330 bits. Good lord, Eric, why? Why do you choose to do this? You don't have to do this. 
Guys, there's a hype train. Oh my, guys, there's a hype train. Guys, hype train. You guys know what to do. You guys know what to do. Freak out, everybody. There's a hype train. There's only two minutes and 30 seconds left. Let's go crazy. What are my other ones? Oh, that's just air now. That's not right. Thank you for the 11 bits. Let's go. Okay, what's this one? Yay! Bruh. Nope, that's still bruh. All right, that's fine. More big breaches. Yay! This is the most chaotic response I could have to a hype train ever. <laughs> okay, uh, so this is this is working. If I die, I can restart a bunch. And now if we complete it again, it should be the same time, same number of deaths, same number of respawns. Cool, same. <laughs> Thank you for the 10 bits. Appreciate you guys. How does the how does a hype train? I literally don't know how a hype train works. Okay, will it work if I do this again? I continue. Okay, cool. That all stays the same. Thank you for the 10 bits. Appreciate you guys. How does this work? Hype train starts multiple viewer support. Okay, cool. Once hype train is underway, the community fills up the hype meter. I can't see the hype meter. Um we're eating to this. Everybody E. If you guys can't add to the hype train, just E. Just go crazy with the E's. I've been live on the stream that broke the world hype train world record. It was insane. Yeah, I heard about that. I was not there for that, but I heard about it. Interesting. Well, now is your reminder that if you have a free Twitch Prime... If you have a Twitch... If you, if you Prime available, then you can subscribe for free. It's free. It's available right there on the side of the screen. A Prime Gaming Benefits Reminder. Or next to the hammer. Or if you scroll down and you subscribe and check the little box that says use Prime Sub. It's free, guys. Did I say it's free? Yeah. That's the thing. Um, do it now or forever hold your hype train, I guess. All right, anyway... <laughs> Uh, okay. How even? What else do we do? That works now, so that's good. And if we play, it's got the continue button always now. And if we hit new game... No, if we... Okay, if we hit continue, and I exit out, I rage quit, it does not show the other thing anymore. So now that's good. Okay. Cool. I also realize now that all the other texts that are floating need the outline as well, so that's a little annoying. Alright. Congratulations on the hype train, everybody. I don't know what that does or means, but I appreciate you guys going crazy with your <laughs> with your bits. You you and your bits war. I appreciate it. Alright, uh let's see. I want to go into Confirm new. <laughs> Thank you, Eric, for another 10 bits. <laughs> Almost got it in time. Almost got it in time. Thank you, Maker, for the another 10 bits. Yeah, Eric. Well, I can't. I'll tell him in a minute. I was going to say, Eric, instead of, um, instead of spending money on bits, why not subscribe? Because ads. See, ads is a problem. Why would, would just, like, instead of spending that money on bits, you could sub and then you wouldn't have to deal with ads thank you for another 10 <laughs> jesus christ eric is still going even during the ads i haven't gotten one ad ever i don't i do believe that because you're subbed so congratulations <laughs> thank you maker are you guys just are you guys fighting for the top spot now is that what's happening let's see what's the what's the top spot the top spots a andres the 500 i feel like you guys are approaching very close yeah eric's at 480 eric you're 20 away from the top spot which, that doesn't feel right. I feel like the top spot is higher than that, but maybe I'm wrong. Um, or maybe it's just the top spot since this has been active, so it only knows back to that point, but... <laughs> Two minutes with long, goofy ad. Oh. Guys, everybody 07 to the people with ads. 07s. Go crazy with the 07s. Thank you for the bits. 07s like crazy. 39 bits. Thank you, Maker. I appreciate it. Did Maker just win? Did Maker just take the top spot? Maker's very close. I don't know how fast it updates, but 07s to all the people with ads. I think the ads are done, though, so no more 07s. Welcome back. Yeah, so Eric, um, I, I'm assuming your ads are done. Uh, here, here's the thing. Instead of spending your money on bits, you could have 
spent that money to sub because then you wouldn't get ads and it would still support me and you probably would have spent less actually I don't know what it is in total but whatever uh, you would have spent about the same amount and then you wouldn't have to deal with the ads so it would be better for you but I appreciate it either way hello again Oh, what was your watch doing? Playing music. Why? I don't know. Okay. It was the watch, everybody. We found the answer. The watch was miraculously playing music. Uh, yeah. On its own. On its own. The, the, the demon from the basement. That's what you guys were saying, right? Yeah. I'm not subbed. How dare, maker. How dare. <laughs> not even people I subscribe to. Really? You've just never got it? Oh, it's because you have an ad blocker, don't you? All right. All right, Joe. 07 to all the lost ads. All right. That stays the same. That's fine. The pro Oh, that was the other problem, was it's resetting our position when we spawn in. Uh, no, it's not. Not anymore. Because I fixed that. Because the load was a success, so we can spawn back in at the starts. Or no, yeah, yeah. So here takes the spawn point that we saved at last. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Good. Wait, no, because it re-triggers when you restart. Ooh, that's a problem. So, okay, that's what it's going to do. When we hit the save point... It needs to do a check if the game is complete or not. Because if the game is complete, then we're not going to add the save point. Complete. Is the game complete? If it is, then we're not going to do that. We're just going to do... I guess we'll just not save it. Because it can still do... No, I just wanted to save it. Okay, we'll just flip these. That's fine. So it'll play the sound no matter what. And then it'll check... Because if it needs to be done, then it can do everything here. If not, it won't do anything after it. Cool. So then I can do this. Like this. If it's not complete, it'll do this. If it is complete, then it doesn't matter. Cool. That fixes that. Okay. Now it won't save when we reset. Sweet. How do I undo and give you ad money? <laughs> Uh, no ad blocker, just legit don't get ads. I don't know why. You got really lucky, Joe. Don't worry. It's it, Ad revenue from one one watcher is not very much. It's it's We're talking like half a pennies here. How do you undo and give me ad money? I don't know if that's possible. I don't know if that's possible, but you could sacrifice bits, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't put you up to that. Refund me the bits so I can send you more. I don't think that's how bits work. I hate to break it to you, but I don't think that refunding you money gives me more money. I think that's called a pyramid scheme that went awry. Alright, uh, let's see. Here, I can turn this off. That's, I think, everything. Let me look at my list. Okay. Camera glitch in the last room. That was one thing. Okay, so here's here's where the camera reaches in this last room. It reaches to right there. So that's why our body of the bean was still barely in it. So I guess I could take this and scale it down ever so slightly. Why is that at an angle? That's not right. E excuse me? W excuse me? Hello? Oh, I was just grabbing the wrong thing. Wait, no. Is it? I have no idea. Wait, no, that's the wrong one. Uh, I'm confused. Laser hit. No, it's this one. Oh, I was selecting the wrong box. That's why. This one. This. Okay, there we go. I'll just bring it back like half and that'll save that. Okay, that's better. There we go. That fixes that problem. Okay. Can continue after complete game. We fixed that. Continue after complete game. Starts at checkpoint one and starts timer. We changed that. Allows death counter. We changed that. Okay. We fixed all the things that I had noted. So I think that's everything. All right. 
And give me all my money back when I beat the speedrun challenge. <laughs> I mean, later on, there is potential for that to happen. So you're, you're right about that. Venno obviously loves me more if he wanted to refund money who would have refunded me instead. Of course, of course, of course. De definitely. Yeah, yeah. For sure. I mean, to be fair, Maker is the cause of the crazy I was crazy once ban. So, Maker does, a and the Minecraft incident, Maker does have a couple strike against him. So, you know. Okay, uh, what else can we do? What else is there to do for this? Other than music, which I'd like to- Oh, that was- That's what I was doing. I got distracted in the middle of doing what I was trying to fix. That has that. Good. Uh, this is fine. I guess, actually, these could have it. Caused a lot of things now that I think about it. Yeah, Maker's- Maker's gonna have an existential crisis realizing all the things they've caused. <laughs> These can have, no, that's too much, uh, one outline, and that'll be more than enough, because it was already prominent enough, so I'll just add that to make it stand out a bit more. Why is it banned? Well, back a while ago, when I was streaming on YouTube, uh, turns out when people spam crazy I was crazy once, uh, gets kind of annoying to read chat, so I, uh, I just, I uh, banned it, you know? And now, now other streamers who don't have that, everybody who goes into their chats and people are talking crazy, I was crazy once, then everybody in, everybody from my streams has, gets PTSD. It's kind of hilarious. Because they all, they all start freaking out like, no, everybody stop, don't do it. <laughs> Alright, this will have two. And then this is the last one. This will have two. Cool. Alright, that solves that. Uh, that was the last little detail. Oh, uh, also the main menu here. This needs it as well. Also, that is a little bit... No, oh, that needs to be one. It's a little too dark, I think. So maybe 0.75. Yeah, that's better. Cool. I'm good with that. I just don't want it to be super prominent. Like, I want it to be there, but not, like, the main focus of it. Even though it's still kind of hard to read, so it does need to be big. <laughs> does need to be bigger. This can be 18, probably. That's probably fine. That's better. I still don't really like the way that's positioned, but... And I guess I could just bring it up closer. I had it outside of the vertical box, but it could just go there. Maybe just 5. And that's fine. I don't know why I didn't just do that in the first place. That's fine. Yeah, maybe it should just be white. Maybe it should. Excuse me. Maybe it should just be dark, and the outline should be white. So I could do this, and then the outline will be white, and then this will be white as well. Yeah, that doesn't look as good. I guess I could just remove this. That's okay. Eh, maybe I need to change the font. No. I don't have a bold version of this one. That feels like it stands out too much. Because if I did that to make it look better, it stands out way too much. Eh, maybe it doesn't. Maybe it, because it fits in with the bean. I don't know, what do you guys think? I don't want it to be too aggressive looking. I guess I could do the other way around and just not have a shadow and just have an outline. Do this and then this. Keep it simple. It looks fine. That looks better than it did. I'd prefer it that way instead. But I think it's still too large. I think if I do that, that's better. That's fine. I don't know why I'm worried about that. I care way too much about UI. Uh, it gives me this by default, which is kind of annoying, but that's fine. Why is the name Capsule Fracture? Because I haven't come up with a better name yet. Uh, but also because of this. You're a capsule, and you fracture. 
that's that's it. That's that's the best I've been able to come up with. I don't know. I'm I'm indecisive. I like capsule fracture, but I don't like it that much. Where I'm like, this is the name. That's the working title right now because I I have no idea what else to do for it. Also, the double music is strange. Oh, also I've completed. So I thought it was a bean. I mean, it's a bean. It's a capsule. It's a pill. Whatever you want to call it. It's not really a bean, and bean isn't an aggressive enough name for this to be, you know, for this as a rage game. I want it to sound aggressive, and bean sounds kind of childish and silly, and we already have bean game. I am bean is my bean game, um, for Jacksepticeye, but, uh, capsule sounds more adult, in a way, just because, I mean, what child do you ever hear saying capsule? But it also doesn't fit, because when you think capsule, you think, like, time capsule and that's not really fitting uh, if I new game this will it start me over it does and then everything works again good cool and then if we quit out and we continue it starts from here okay cool a hard pill, pill to swallow I like that too but it does not at all fit the vibe of this like prototype game because if it were like I saw I think spoon suggested in there like and then you can change all the walls to be like a fleshy color if it were that then it would make total sense but in this circumstance it doesn't really fit i do like the name though but in this case no nah. i want to stay away from pill because you're not a pill that's not what this is meant to be you're just a prototype capsule also i can't believe that counted i should make this a little bit smaller maybe because it is a little bit forgiving I don't necessarily want it to be forgiving. Eh, I don't know. Because I could just make this like 40 by 40 by 40. Or I guess this could still be, this could be 25 and then just down uh, in the construction script. Uh, that's not being used. Oh, I don't need to do that in the construction script. I just need to do this. Negative 25. I guess I could make that even smaller. Just make this like 10. Make this uh, negative 40. Yeah. That works better. Because then uh, it doesn't work better. Um, I guess it does, but it doesn't. So I guess I should just make it like a really small change. Where is it? Hello? Where did it go? Hello? Hello? There it is. Uh, Like 45 by 45. Because it's never going to be huge, but... Or at least there now it's offset slightly so you'll still be able to touch it no matter what but it won't like give you that immediate success if you just barely tap it and like this that's fine that one's fine so that, that way the check ones will be a little bit harder to get a little bit more you have to actually hit it before you achieve it i'm cool with that Trials of Capsule Fracture. Way too long. Way too long. Angry little pill. <laughs> angry little pill. Well, he's not angry. He's just trying to survive, you know? I love the music combo here. This is very fitting. I don't know, but that is really like the last thing we have to figure out. Is... What is the name? What are potential future obstacles and goals that we're going to have for the game? Because those are things I'm going to write down and start work on soon. But... Unrelenting capsule trials. I don't really like unrelenting. It's a bit too, too much. And I don't really like trials. Trials doesn't fit because this is... Trials, like I said earlier, it fits the idea of like what is going to be in the full game, but I don't like it as part of the title. Spike smash? That would make more sense if you actually smashed the spikes, or the spikes, the spikes smashed you, but they more kind of just stab you. I don't really want spikes in the title either, though. I'm just kind of casually playing this now. Me6 has been completely locked behind a paywall. Great! 
So how is it, is it still running at all on the server? Because that's weird if so. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Whoa, my god, I'm a god gamer. Alright, We. Oh, barely made that. Nice. Well. Also, do you like yellow as the checkpoint color? Uh, should I make it, like, turn green when you touch it? Because I haven't done that yet, and I like- yellow's fine, but it's not that great. It looks kind of weird to me. It's almost like a green, and I don't really like the yellow-green color that it is. But also, I don't know what else to do, because blue and orange is already taken, so it can't be blue. Green would imply that it's already in use. It's me, yellow! It sure is! It's Joe and Candace, yellow. The perfect yellow. Well, that was bad. It's, it is, it's like a dark yellow. I don't really like that. Yellow is mellow. It is, yellow is mellow after all. If you guys don't know that reference, uh, go subscribe to the second channel. You guys know the deal. Oh. Woo. Woo. I'm not at all locked in for this. And you can probably tell. Add a bit of glow. I guess I could make it kind of emissive. Let's try that. Where is it? There's the cube. Oh, does this have a emissive? Oh, it does. Two? Five? Ten? There's no emissive. Why? Uh, okay, it cannot have emissive, apparently. That is not a thing. I don't know why that's an option, then. What? Why are these options? If they do nothing, why are they options? Okay, that yellow was terrible though. I see why that looks so gross. It was a terrible yellow. It's because of the white outline. Hmm. That's way better. Well, that's way better already. Jesus. Why didn't I do that before? Rage pilled. I don't want pilled in the title. I don't like pilled. Jump hazard. Jump hazard's good. Jump Hazard is really good. I don't know if I want Jump in the name, but Jump Hazard is really good. Bean Block Breakdown. <laughs> it sounds like a, a Dance Dance Revolution game. Capsule Hazard? I don't like that as much. Coming up with a name is definitely the hardest part. It still looks kind of green to me. Am I crazy? Where's that color? Hello? Did I close it? No, I didn't. It's here. It's because it's still not really... Like, that's more orange. That's more yellow. I'm trying to keep it away from the green. That's almost orange. That doesn't look as good. Let's see. B, 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 I like. Of course you do. Fracture hazard. Hmm. Let's see. Is it ARD? It is ARD. Need more saturation? Well, here's the thing, Eric. The post-process adds a bunch of saturation, so this is about as saturated as you're going to get. And if I go lighter, then the white doesn't fit, which I, I could do if I can... No, not that one. This one. If I can do... If I just do that... Nope, that's the wrong one again. Is it this one? Nope. Is it this one? Nope. Is it this one? No? Which one is it? Really? It's gotta be this one. It has to be this one. Yeah, okay. If I do this, then I could do that. Oh my god, it's blinding. Uh, and then you can't really tell anymore. Can I add like a thickness to this? Is there a thickness modifier? I guess I could just bring this down a little bit. 
Yeah, the black doesn't look as good there. It's better. It's better like this. Yeah. Make her sleep. I don't know why we're yelling at make her to sleep, but make her, I agree. Go sleep. Yeah, we did bring it slightly orange. That's why it's able to be yellow right now. and It's less green. Uh, but if I want any further than that, it'd be more orange. And I don't want it orange. I could potentially make it more... Like I could, like I said, I could potentially make it green when you touch it for like a second. Which I think might be the solution. So if I do this, this will be checkpoint lit. And then I'll make it green. When you touch it, it'll glow green for a second uh, in... Where is it? There it is. So when I do this, it's going to do this. I think it'll do it no matter what, actually. We will set the cube set. Actually, we'll do a sequence here. Sequence to do all of this and then set material zero to cube lit. Or not cube lit. Uh, checkpoint lit. And then we'll delay for a second and then go back. Uh, it'll be a retriggerable. Retriggerable delay of one second, not ten seconds. And then go back to regular checkpoint. That might be better. Where did you get the master material from? It's from some asset. I think it's from uh, a grid asset pack or something. I don't remember specifically. Alright, so if I continue, turns green for a second. It's green for a second. I could also make it ding when you touch it. No, wait, no, it, it makes a sound already. It's not making the sound now. Because it's, it's the existing checkpoint, that's why. <laughs> Thank you, Maker, for the 180 bits. <laughs> why? Why are you still going? I appreciate it, but why? Aren't you supposed to be going to bed or something? Uh, I want this to play even if it is the same. Checkpoint. So we'll do this first, and then we'll do this. So here, I can do this. Think of that. Let's see. I play it every time, but... It's playing it twice now, though, too. Yeah, so it does that when we touch it. That's cool. That's better. I like that. 690. I see why. I see. I see. I understand. Okay, I understand now. <laughs> Congratulations, Maker. So that's, that's better. Because then there's more of a visual, too, to let you know that, hey, you actually reached the checkpoint. Do I want to keep it? I guess I could also just do... It's green when you're in range... Uh, and then, where is that? Where is it? Hello? Hello? Why do I keep losing it? Why do I have everything open right now? Uh, we can also do a end overlap with the player. Instead of doing it on a timer, it could just be this. And then set it back afterwards, which I think will probably be better. Now it's green, yellow, green, yellow. There should be a delay there after we leave it. Slight delay. For one second is fine. So that way we can hit it. And when we jump off, it stays green for a second. Maybe half a second. See, this is my nitpickiness coming in. Trying to be all, all careful about how I design this. Wait, what? Okay. I don't know why I did that a second ago. Tic Tac Total. What is up with you and your anagrams or whatever they're called? What are they called? What's that? What is it when you do 
three of the same, or like multiple of the same starting sound. What is that? I can't remember. Whatever, you know what I'm talking about. Why, why, why are you so obsessed with those? Whatever they're called. I can't think of them. I can't think of the name of it. Also, my phone's going to die. Why are you going to die? Phone, calm down. Alliteration. That's the one. Anagram, alliterate. Close enough. <laughs> okay. Close these. Close this, 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 this. Jesus Christ, there's so much open. Okay. Uh, last thing would be in the player. When we respawn, or it's in the player controller now. Here... When we respawn, we play a sound. That's the jump sound. There's respawn. Spawn, we play a sound, not respawn. Spawn, which is in player. Here. We spawn, we play sound somewhere here. We're going to skip that, and let's see if it still goes without. It's playing multiple. It's playing multiple on that first one. The second time it's fine. Hmm. Maker redeemed hydrate. I see. Cheers, Maker. <laughs> Does the game have any backstory to it? No, nothing immediate. Like nothing that I'm like set on. But the general idea. And people, people have wanted me to do like some voice acting for the game, or like narration of sorts, kind of like Bennett Foddy does. Um, good night, Maker. Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate you. Thank you for all the bits. Um, the idea right now is that this is an unfinished game, even though at some point it will be finished. This is an unfinished game. It's a prototype, and you are testing it. Uh, and the idea of the game is that you want to get out of the facility, and that's that's the backstory, right? The it's it's a very meta game. That's that's kind of the idea that I'm going for. I shall help. I am good voice actor. Well, so here's the thing. Nothing else needs a voice actor. I'll, uh, Joe, I'll have you, I'll have you voice the robots. The, uh, and by robots, I mean the, the cameras. The, you can do the... It's just, just that. It's just that, but better. I'll voice the spikes. <laughs> Uh, okay, so, yeah, but yeah, that's basically it for the backstory in terms of, like, story for the game. I don't know where I'm gonna go with it, but that's the idea for now. Uh, why is it playing multiple when I spawn? Am I hitting this multiple times? It's not clicking multiple times, is it? If I print a string, tell me what's happening. Tell me what's happening, game, please. Hit continue. It is. It's hitting it twice. Why is it hitting it twice? Uh, I guess I should just do a do once. Uh, do once. And then reset it once this happens. Uh, so sequence. That's weird that it does it multiple times. Do this and then reset it. Cool. So now that should only happen once. Still did it twice. It still did it twice. Excuse me? Am I stupid? Do once is so useful when you have to debug something. Uh, it's so it's annoying though when it doesn't actually do what it's supposed to do. Is it still running it twice? For some reason, because it sounds like it is. Also, I'm getting rid of this because that's not how I'm gonna do it now. But is that still doing it? It is. It's still do once. So it's because it's disconnecting it. So I'm I'm apparently unoverlapping it, which doesn't make any sense. So I guess I could just add a tiny delay of like one frame. You know, I could probably even do it as one frame, a one frame delay, and then reset it. Nope, one frame is not enough. Okay, like a point one. That's better. I don't see a world where you would need to reset it faster than that. Probably hitting the checkpoint you spawn at before the save kicks in. 
maybe, but it is just directly teleporting you, so that's weird. That wouldn't make sense. But it doesn't matter, because it worked. It, actually, no, so it had to be this one because it was resetting on this one. So it had to be this one, it was hitting it twice somehow. So it was hitting it, unhitting it, and then hitting it again, but the delay fixed it, so that's fine. That works. I'm good with that. Because there's no world where that happens, where, where like you hit it again faster than... I mean, even that, really. Yeah. Yeah, there's no world you hit that faster than that, so it's fine. The world load spawns you at the start and then teleports you to the actual... But you spawn in before that, so like this is the same world here, and you're already possessing the character. So if I hit continue, it's teleporting us directly here. So I don't know why it's hitting it twice. The loading wouldn't make sense unless it's because... But it wouldn't be distance gold either because it's a trigger. I don't know. It, it doesn't make any sense. It doesn't matter. Doesn't matter why it's not working as long as it works now. But yeah, now the green is cool. I'm cool with that. That works. Looks good. Looks like a bank vault escape. Yeah, kind of. That's kind of the idea. The I mean, the ending is a little escape pod that I threw together in Blender in like five minutes. And then combined with a couple random pieces uh, in in the actual world. Which is not the way to do this because these are just it's two cylinders and two cubes that I did not attach to this. So not made well, but it works because I'm not a modeler and I don't care. And that's why this game works so well for me. It's because I don't have to be good at modeling. I can just make a game. You see your name suggestion. No. I did not. I saw that you made uh, your enchilada uh, enchilada paint. Good job, Eric. I had enchiladas this morning. My name would be hard to swallow. Yeah, so someone said hard pill to swallow, um, which I like as a name, but the problem with it is it, you're not a pill. And it's assuming like a hard pill to swallow, right? Hard to swallow. Swallow even. It just doesn't fit the aesthetic because uh, it's like this would have to be fleshy and it's not going to be. It's going to be, you know, grid based. So unfortunately, that doesn't work as well. Home and able to be around much more often. Well, thank you, Rose. Appreciate you hopping in. Welcome back. A vault venture. It's it's not a vault though. It looks kind of like a vault, but it's not a vault. What is it right now? Fracture hazard. I'm I'm not liking hazard as much. I'm not liking hazard as much now. At least not next to fracture. Jump hazard is great. Yeah, yeah I don't like hazard really. It's a good idea, but I'm not, I'm not, it's not hitting me like, yeah, that's the one. You know, I'm still waiting for the, like, that's the one. I don't know. I gotta pee. I'll be back. Uh, keep thinking, gamers. Uh, brainstorm. I'll be right back.
fractioned focus. That doesn't fit, unfortunately. Uh, yeah, no, fraction. It's not fraction, it's fracture. <laughs> Different words. Good try, though. I'm drinking some honey. My voice is not going. You know how sometimes Doug Doug drinks olive oil on stream? I drink honey. That's my thing. Crack hazard? I don't like crack. I don't like crack or break. I think if we're going to use a word to describe what happens to the bean, it's going to have to be fracture. Unless you guys can hit me with a more aggressive, intense sounding one. It feels like he was on crack when he made it. Fractured jump hazard. I don't want to put fracture in past tense, and I think that might be too long. Plus, the jump isn't fractured, so that wouldn't work. It would be jump fracture hazard, which doesn't sound as good. Doug Doug drinks olive oil for another reason, though. Of course, of, of course, I know. But I, I drink honey to solve my voice. See, he's not drinking olive oil to solve his voice. I'm not doing this because just, just for fun. I'm doing it to help my voice. Because I really think, I think that's like the last thing we're stuck on here. Other than music for the demo, which I think we're just going to leave with this. Because this is, like it says here, proof of concept demo. That's what this is. This is this is a very baseline, simple one. It does The menus don't work with controller. This will get updated to a demo at some point, I'm sure. With like updated menu working and potentially other levels, maybe, probably not. I don't know, we'll see. <laughs> Raw dog in the honey. Don't ever say it like that. Jumping over it with Planet Vano. Of course, of course. That looks kind of cool. Okay, I thought that was broken for a second, but now that works. Cool. I'm good with that. Does, it does play that when I respawn, right? Yes. If I die... Okay. Uh, I didn't hear it a second ago, but okay, it still works. That's good. Hmm. So far, I think Capsule Fracture is the best one I've been able to come up with. I'm still kind of on the fence about it. I do have time. It's not like I'm going to release this immediately today. I know a lot of people want to play it. People want to play this badly, and I know, I know. But I've got to make the video first before I release it anyway. So I've got a couple days at least before this goes up. So I've got some time to think, but I'm still looking for that... That, that desire. Did I fix the double jump issue? It's not an issue, it's on purpose. Uh, so that's not, I'm not getting rid of that. It is It is meant to be there. Because the idea is that you can hold jump. That's all that's happening is you can hold jump. So if you don't let go of jump in time, you're gonna double jump like that. So it, it's, it's there on purpose. You just have to be able to let go of jump. Sprint to success. There's a lot more than sprinting going on here. Dash to freedom. There's no dashing. I get the idea, though. It has to sound aggressive. Because it is a rage game. Because do think, like, it's a prototype facility. You're a capsule slash bean, but bean doesn't sound aggressive enough. And you fracture or break or explode when you hit something lethal. Not necessarily just spikes, but spikes are a huge enemy, of course. The combustion rooms. Anger management. Definitely one of the most accurate names. Eternal fracture. Eh, eternal doesn't really fit. I 
I mean, it's good. the best one so far is just Fracture, but that's a, that's already the name of a game, and that's where my problem comes into play, because it's like I could just use Fracture, but I don't want to get that confused with the existing game Fracture from like 2013 or whatever, you know. Bonkus test one, Bonkus fracture. Of course, we're going a little off the rails here. A little distracted. Fracture restart. No. No. It's really tough. If you don't have a good title to start with, it's really hard to come up with a good title. Because there have been a lot of projects I've worked on where it's like the title was the first thing I came up with, and that's really easy. Usually at the end the very end of the project. It's pretty easy to come up with a title But sometimes like this time you still have a really really hard time went up with titles for it rip capsule rip sanity I'm getting better at the skip there. That's nice Spiky fracture I don't know. I don't know. I'm really indecisive on this one. I'm really indecisive on this one because I want it to sound epic and intense and scary, but also fit the vibe of the fact that, the, like, the reason you're a capsule in the first place is because the whole point of this is that this is an unfinished game. This is a prototype. But it's also a very difficult game on purpose, you know? Streamer's Nightmare. I had a game idea a while ago called Four Streamers, and that's it. Literally a game just made four streamers to challenge their skill at video games. But I'm not a skilled enough gamer to make a game about being a skilled gamer, so this is the best, this is the closest I can get to that. The anger prototype. I'm trying to stay away from the prototype or like prototype as a word in it because especially like being used as a noun because of the prototype from poppy playtime which is a pretty popular like villain now in modern media and i don't want to i don't want to be associated with the horror aspect of things in a rage game you know because i can just see that immediately people playing this and, and you know associating prototype with prototype from Poppy Playtime, just because of how popular it is. Not that there's any real association, just word association, but still. Jesus Christ. That's terrifying. My mouse lagged. Good job, wireless mouse. Thank you for doing your job exactly as intended. <sighs> okay, that was scary. Breakout Abyss. I don't want Breakout, because Breakout is a game of its own. And there's it's not the Abyss, either. Abyss doesn't fit as a word. If anything, it would be, like, Escape the Facility. Like, on my list was Escape the Prototype, but that literally just sounds like a Poppy Playtime fan game at this point. Escape the Fracture is fine, but it doesn't really fit the game. I don't know. It, that just doesn't feel fitting to me. Capsule Fracture is like the most basic, like, baseline, hey, that's what this game's about. You're a capsule that fractures, and that's it. You know? So it works, but... I don't know how I feel about it. Facility Fracture. I don't want facility. Maybe, like... Yeah, because, like, escape the facility is fine. Facility fracture is fine, but it... I don't think I want to add facility to it, necessarily. Also, why is that happening? Why was that doing that? That didn't... That's not right. Yeah, when I respawn, it just gets rid of it. That's weird. So it thinks when I respawn that it's... That's a problem. I'm gonna figure that out. Send medical. I can't tell if you're giving name suggestions or if you need medical help immediately. So that's a little concerning. Can't name the game that. That would be too confusing. 
I don't know. I also realize I never changed the title back, so I'm not necessarily- Oh, I forgot about that one. I'm not necessarily trying to get a uh, PB now, but... I was earlier. I need to fix that. For whatever reason, when we spawn there... It's spawning and then immediately unspawning. Which doesn't make sense. In here. So maybe it's not this that's doing it. Maybe it's... I need a thing here that is player overlapping, just a boolean, to tell me that the player is overlapping. And then here, we're going to tell it player is not overlapping whenever this happens, and then we're going to do this delay, and then we're going to check again to see if the player has started overlapping again. And if it has not, then we will do, then we will reset this. Wait, no. That's not right. No, it would do... I'm doing this wrong. It'd be this. Uh, to do that there. And then... Here... We're going to tell it that it's not overlapping. And then we're going to delay. And then we'll check again after the point five. Are we overlapping? If we are overlapping, then don't... If we aren't overlapping, then do that. If we are overlapping... Okay, there we go. That should fix it, theoretically. Let's see if my big brain is working right now. Continue. Cool. I get off of it, and it still thinks I'm overlapping. Really? What? So I tell it it's overlapping. Here, I, ch I, I tell it that it's not overlapping anymore. Oh, I didn't connect it. <laughs> I'm just an idiot. Good job, me. It did it again. No, that's not working. Why is that doing that? It does this, and then it checks. Is the player overlapping? So here, we're telling it. Okay, so instead of doing this after the do once, I just need to do it here. And then do the do once. There we go. Okay, that fixes it. i do this. Good. Respawn. And it stays there. Okay. That's good. That works. It's in alpha. Uh, what did I miss? What did I miss? Game doesn't have enough lore for us to find the epic name you're looking for. Not necessarily. Not necessarily. Because the game name doesn't have to be built around the lore, necessarily. Uh, I think it could work fine without having a bunch of lore behind it. Uh, do, 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 do. Okay, uh, let's see. What? Okay, first I gotta figure this stupid thing out. Why is this doing this? Oh, wait, no, that just worked. What am I doing? No, the other part of it, okay, this works, but the other part of it didn't because when you respawn, if you're already on it, then it's not gonna play the sound. So if... We respawn. When you hit a spawn point, it needs to play the sound. When you respawn, it needs to play the sound, but not if we're respawning. It's in alpha as a whole name is interesting. But I'd rather not, because then that implies things. I mean, it's, it's a funny, like, meta joke, but I'd rather I'd rather go for a more... Unique name. That's related to the gameplay, you know. I'm sleeping. <laughs> good night. Good night, I I guess. <laughs> I, you are currently asleep. Good night. <laughs> Should have a small area that looks realistic. Why would I do that, Eric? <laughs> There's no shot this game runs on your mobile phone if that's the case. Alright, how can I skip... Because I needed to... Tell me if it's... Because if it jumps to here, then... Because it's not... Okay, so I would have to check if you're dead when you spawn, but then after you spawn, set dead to false, or after... I, that wouldn't work. 
I don't use my Eric. I wasn't talking directly to you. I was saying like then this can't be played on your phone. You know. Okay, never mind. It's all right. I think this will be one of those things that I figure out off stream. I don't want to keep going too much longer because I. I mean, this is going to be a, a little bit shorter stream today, but. Uh, we, we, we've got well, a lot of the things set up. Was it supposed to be not, not like a hundred percent, but I would like it to be able to like, it's simple. There's no lighting. It, I would like it to be simple enough to where it could run on a phone. Right. That's the, that's the idea. I know that's hard to do with unreal, but with how little is going on in this game performance wise, it should be able to run on a phone. Plus keeping the aesthetic consistent is important. Okay, let's see if I can't figure this out right now. So if you respawn, it's going to play the sound. So right now, if I were to take this out of it, if I were to just remove this sound here and just play this in the player when we respawn, then it won't play it when we hit it. A light device that the person is playing on the game. What? A light device that... What are you, what are you talking about, Eric? <laughs> I have no idea what you're trying to get at. Uh, okay, then... Do you mean what? It's easy to be thrown? I have no idea what you're trying to say. Good try, though. Alright, uh, spawn in, play the sound. And then, when we land on the sound, land on the sound, when we land on the checkpoint, I don't want it to play twice. So, I guess I could just spawn the sound and then check if it's, if it's, if it exists. That's probably the solution here. Spawn sound, uh, nope. Spawn sound at location. There's location, click five. Really? Fine. This one. Okay. There we go. Hashtag throw Eric. Yes, of course. Uh, this will be respawn sound. Respawn sound. And then we'll check if it's valid when we try to play it. So now I can go in here and then check get sound, whichever one it is, respawn sound, playing, is playing. If it is playing, then we won't play it. So I can, we're, we're doing the outro music right now apparently. Don't worry, we're going we're gonna to do this again here in a second. Um, if is playing, if it's not playing, then we'll play it. If it is playing, then we will just skip it and then there we go. That'll work. Cool. All right. Pause this music for a second because we have to test this and make sure I'm a genius. Okay. Now we just have to find out if that actually works normally as well. So if I spawn me back there, I need to change this, get rid of my save. Nice. Cool. Sweet. Works. Okay. Uh, this didn't work. So it needs to be validated again. Fine. Easy enough. That's that's not bad at all. Just validated get. Jesus Christ. If it is valid, if it's not valid, ignore my spaghetti code. It works, so I don't care. There we go. Okay. Yes. Uh, actually, if it's not valid at all, then we will play it anyway. Right? Yes. Okay. Cool. Easy enough. That works. Alright. Sweet. So there you have it, boys. That is the end of today's work. I think that's everything. Except for controller support, which is... The nightmare that I will endure next, because, like I said, controller does work. Controller, let me connect my controller. Controller does work. It just does not work with the menus. 
So, like, I'm playing with controller right now. You can see, I'm, I'm playing with controller. It does, in fact, work, but not with the menus, because the menus is a nightmare. It can open the menu, it can't close the menu, and it can't control the menu until you click on something. Yeah, you literally have to actually click it, and now I can't press it again. Why can't, oh, my controller's disconnecting. Okay, my controller does not want to stay connected. Come on, controller. There we go. So yeah, you can do that, but you can't actually go in here unless you do like this. And then you can move the control with the controller, which doesn't make sense. Also, you can't press any of the buttons. You could before, but not anymore. I don't know why. I don't know why it doesn't work. Can I do this? Nope. Uh, can I? Nope. Literally can't do anything with controller. So I'm gonna have to complete. And now it's gone. The the, the controller option is just gone. So now I have to go back to mouse. So I'm gonna have to completely overhaul the controller system, which is fine. I'll deal with that. I've done that before. I'll do it again. But there we have it. That is broken. That's very broken. Why did it... It took me back to the... Why did it take me back to the main menu? Oh, no. Pause settings from pause and then settings save and return from pause pause menu show me why did it show me why did it do that why did that, that doesn't make any sense it's because I was using controller did controller break it that much Did, really? Okay, I guess controller just broke it that much. That doesn't really make sense, but okay. Uh, anyways, all right, that's fine because it doesn't matter. We're gonna end the stream here. I'm I'm exhausted of, of explaining everything. I'm gonna go uh, re relax my voice because for whatever reason my voice does not like me today. Um, but more importantly, start working on the stupid controller support. But I've also been working since like four four thirty a.m. So who knows what'll happen next? Either way. That is going to do it for me today, gamers. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate you guys, appreciate you guys hanging out. Thank you for all the bits and all the support today. That was insane. That was hilarious that we got a hype train going because of that. Uh, but thank you guys. And, uh, and, and I'll see you guys again tomorrow night, which I believe will be us finishing, potentially, if Jacob is alive, uh, potentially first Jacob and I completing Sons of the Forest because we still haven't beaten the game and we're extremely close. I know we're extremely close. I, well, actually, I don't know how close we are, but uh, tomorrow night. So it'll be the first non-game dev stream in over a week. So 07s to the game dev stuff, but most of this will be behind the scenes from now on. So not from now on, but for the rest of this project specifically. So, you know, yeah, let's go. Why did that get bit? Why did that that doesn't make any sense. Good, good try, Eric. <laughs> you got auto-modded because you can't spell. Bye bye everybody! See you guys! Bye guys! Ignore my wrist rest thing. See you guys! Bye bye Thank you guys for being here. Let's fade out this time. Here we go. See you guys! Bye 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 now. Goodbye now. Goodbye. Goodbye everybody. Goodbye. Goodbye. Good night. Goodbye. Good afternoon. Good morning. Goodbye. Goodbye. Bye bye. Bye bye.